Hello everybody, I hope you are having a comfy, a cozy, and a self-aware Tuesday afternoon. So, I was at work yesterday, and I was uh, I was hosting a Zoom meeting uh, for co-workers, where we uh, talked about work stuff. And uh, I know the, uh, all, the most scintillating stories always start that way, I know, but <laughs> bear with me. <laughs> um, I was, you know, I, I started the, me the meeting the Zoom meeting 10 minutes early to give people plenty of time to trickle in and you know my camera was off my microphone was off people trickled in eventually the last person arrived then the time came to start the meeting um, at which point I turned on my uh, webcam turned on my microphone and then immediately my body went into autopilot and I started saying hello everybody I hope you are having a <laughs> just clamp down on that thought before I tell all my co-workers that I want them to be having a comfy and cozy Monday. That, <laughs> I just don't know why that reflex kicked in so hard, but just, <laughs> don't say comfy cozy at work. Don't say comfy cozy at work. <laughs> I don't, <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> it's, I, I, uh, I managed to, uh, recover and say, you know, hope you're having a... Uh, for the, uh, happy Monday morning. Eh, you know, that kind of thing. <laughs> but, <laughs> just <laughs> strange, like, you know, and, you know, at the end of the meeting, why don't I just, like, you know, tell everyone to like, follow, and subscribe to my LinkedIn, I guess? <laughs> or, you know, share, uh, if, uh, if you are, if you're a fan of this meeting, uh, share a clip on LinkedIn. Get some good professional development that way. I don't know. <laughs> we are back. Let's uh, let's let's uh, unfreeze this man from his suffering. There you go. Wonderful. We are back with Majora's Mask. Not only are we back with Majora's Mask. Where's uh, Pikachu? There's the Moon Man. We're uh, back with Majora's Mask, but we're also finishing Majora's Mask today. Oh heck yeah! Loving that. Do I have? I think I have a bug handy. I do. I happen to have a bug. Let's use it. Why not? I think this is what'll do a thing, shall ya? I happen to have a bug. Why not? We're finishing this today. How exciting! We're in the middle of the first loop of Anju and Cafe's quest. We'll be finishing this up. <laughs> you, you left a uh, Dan Jones VOD to catch my stream. Generous! I shall not look that gift horse in the mouth. And also, hello, Cats Bagels. How are you doing today? Hello, Kai. How are you doing today? Oh, it's a nice day. It's a lovely day to uh, finish Majora's Mask, I think. Uh, let's see. Where we left off. Let's, uh, let's move into a part of town that isn't uh, polluted with the noise of hammering and uh, my sneezing. That was a double sneeze. I'm glad I had my uh, sneeze button handy. It is the good day, Hello, Drish. How are you doing? Hope you're having a good Tuesday. Uh, let's see. Required event number nine at 12 p.m. to 6 p.m. in the laundry pool. Go back to Cafe's hideout. So once it hits noon, we're hitting up the hideout. Wahoo. The uh, Anju and Cafe quest requires two time loops to get all of the items. Uh, we're in the middle of the first time loop here. 
Heck yeah. <laughs> it's a good day. It's a good day to be a good day. Gotta tell you, it feels nice to be nice. Yeah, the uh, <laughs> the the uh, the dissonant uh, pedal tone and the uh, uh, accelerated uh, clock town theme is uh, he gads, he gads almighty. That is some tension-inducing stuff. Um, I do know about uh, accelerating and speeding up, uh, accelerating and slowing down time. Right now, we're waiting for time to. We're waiting for noon, basically. So slowing down time would just make us wait longer. Um, but once it hits noon, I'm gonna walk in this door right behind me, which, in fact, any second now. Five, four, three, two, one. Go! Oh, it's locked. Okay, where is Anju and or Cafe? Do I have to be... How do I get in? Do I wear... It's locked. Is someone going to arrive? How do I get in here? Let's double check that I'm reading the guide, right? Day 3, 12 to 6. That's where we are. Go back to Cafe's hideout at the laundry pool. Oh, do I have to ring the... <laughs> do I have to do the YouTube maneuver? Ring the bell. Uh, nobody's there. Uh... uh. Ain't nobody. Let's see here. Stun mask. Continues being locked. And... Womp. Door? No door. How about now? Oh, okay. Peculiar. Maybe it's... Maybe it's one o'clock to, uh... Anyway, it's fine. Store owner, let's see, what are we actually doing in here now that we're here? Uh, curiosity shop owner, speak to the man! Huh? You're the green hat kid. Well, I'm a kid and I'm wearing a green hat, so I think that I check all of the boxes. I am, in fact, at least a green hat kid. <clears throat> I got a message from Cafe. Now, Cafe, I've known him since he was real little, which is to say, for about five minutes now. Uh, when he showed up looking all young in that little brat body, I didn't know what I was seeing. All it took was one glance at that Keaton mask he was carrying for me to realize that I was looking at my old friend. I gave him that mask a long time ago, when he was just a little cafe. <laughs> the, the little cafe V1.0. Didn't know he kept it that well for so long. I'm not sure why, but I want to give this to you. You got the Keaton mask. It's Cafe's mask of memories. Accepting this keepsake doesn't make much sense to you, but you should take it anyway. Now, Cafe, he says he wants you to take this to his mother. Express mail to Mammy. This is priority mail, so hurry up and deliver it. A customer came to my shop last night. Let's tend to be. Oh, that's that's. Um. Also get a special delivery to Mama. Do I... It doesn't say to actually give that to... Let's see... Um... Is this sort of a branching path here? Bring the letter to the post office. As opposed to... Okay, so this is where we make a choice. We either take the letter we were just given to the post office, or we uh, do uh, what I'm going to do right now. Warp to Ikana Canyon. All right. Now, Cafe sees him, and Cafe's color just changes, and he goes running after the guy. The guy's a regular... A greedy thief named a greedy thief named Sakone. I think he's from Akana Village. 
You listened to his memories. Ask to deliver priority mail. What else you got for me, friend? Okay. Nope, no, no more dialogue. All right. So let's see. Cafe's hideout. Heck yeah, Drish, get those chores done. Be a productive adult. Productivity hype. Um, we are now under some time pressure, so I think now is a good time to slow down time. Slow the flow. Get that flow slowed. Oh, actually, it does have to be... Eh, alright, that's fine. We're up to Akana Canyon and head to the lower area. Go through the dark passage. Warp to Akana Canyon. I know how to do that. Watch me do that. Let's get in there. Alright, go through the dark passage to find a small area. Cafe is hiding behind a rock, waiting for Sakone <clears throat> to appear. The uh, proper noun salad is uh, formidable. So, dark passage A. Eh? Where, oh where? Might this dark passage be? Oh, you're gonna tell me about uh, keys? Alright, well, there's something else we can be doing. In this race against time, we can become a little bunny wabbit. Watch us go. Is the dark passage up here? Far end of the river. Gotcha. Probably not this far. Okay. Gotcha. Having a leap. Getting away from the Gibdos. Gibdos back. This instant. Alright, and... Swan dive! At the far end of the river. I can hook shot, I'm noticing that much. So let's try that. Perhaps this is where we're meant to go. Also this... Oh, we're only missing two masks. Whatever this is, and whatever that is. Try putting this on. What happens if I... No idea. That's fine. Um... Hook shot. Okay, I need to be over there. Uh, and for that I need ice arrows. Oh, dang. Okay. Hang on! <laughs> There's a better way to do this. There's always a better way. Just fast traveling 30 feet is uh, faster than uh, farming for arrows, so I can ice arrow my way across. I was thinking that I slowed down time a little prematurely, but what do you know? It turns out I didn't. It's a good thing. Okay, now where is... Okay... If I do a plummet... Nope, let's plummet to the right a little bit. And there we go. Bullseye! Loving it. Not the ocarina. Oof. Alright, we gotta... Whoa. Do a little bit better. Oh, so close. And yet. There we go. Alright, now we're up here for some reason. Hope there was a reason. Maybe not. <laughs> oh, or is that where we're meant to go? Okay. Well, we do have time. We have to be in the area by 6 p.m. Just after 6 p.m. Yeah, so we got time. Let's see what's over here. Don't actually know. Ooh. 
it's a waterfall. And as we know about waterfalls in video games, there's always something hiding behind them. Waterfalls have no reason to exist except to hide secrets. Secret shrine behind waterfall, now awaiting the challenges of bold visitors to be sure of their might. Hmm. Hmm. Also, that's not the best kept secret in the world. It was literally signposted, but it's fine. Secret shrine. I might, uh, I might check this out. This seems fun. Maybe we'll do this before the, uh, end of the game as well, but... Ooh, uh, at the moment. Time pressure ignites. And over here... Pardon me, jerk to rocks. Let's see, can I get through here then? What all? I see a heart piece over yonder. What's my, uh, what's my heart piece situation looking like? Nowhere near another one, so we'll... <laughs> We'll let that slide. Oh, that's interesting. Neat. I didn't. I didn't. I had. I did not think that these connected at all. All right. It's a pity we have no reason to be here right now. <laughs> it's, it's a pity we have to be on the complete other side of the world at the moment, but. Soar to Ikana. Once more, third time's the charm. Neat, though. I didn't know the uh, the map was connected in such ways. Always, always satisfying to see uh, world continuity like that. Uh, let's see here. Doing a good dive. That's a good dive. That's a good dive from the good Dave. That's how we do here. Last, uh, last place to check, I think, is right over here. So we're gonna check it. Ah, you're gonna tell me a secret, Tattle. It's okay, you don't need to. Ah, there's the heart piece, okay. This looks like a rock. A cafe could be hiding out behind. Indeed it be. Alright. I'm just gonna... I found him. Green Hat Boy. He's using this place as his safe house for keeping his stolen goods. Apparently his name is Sakone. He came to the shop last night and I followed him. His storage for the things he's stolen is on the other side of this rock door. Only Sakone can open it. The only way in is to wait for Sakone to arrive. I'll wait. I've made a promise to Anju. He will show up. Alright. <laughs> That's I mean, you know, if 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 you're gonna if you're gonna jump into water, uh, clenching everything is the uh, is the appropriate response, I think. Don't wanna get uh, don't wanna get Montezuma's revenge or anything. Um is hiding right behind a rock. Wait for Sakone. Hide with Cafe. Then use the Song of Double Time to make it night. Uh, oh, that's right. I can just make it 6 p.m., can't I? All right, but take this time to read. I'll, I'll read Zelda Dungeon.net to ya. Uh, let's see. Uh, Sakone will then appear. Slowly make his way towards the entrance. Stay behind the rock and do not allow him to see you. Caps lock. Do not. Once the thief enters his hideout, Cafe will follow him inside. Once you gain control, follow Cafe inside, where you will work alongside him to get back his wedding ceremony mask. Can I? Let's let's hang out with Cafe, shall we? Ah, uh, but I'm wearing your mask. It still smells like you and everything. I recommend a breath mint, my friend. Although I suppose in a small number of hours that won't matter anyway. 
<laughs> you can't see me. Okay, so you do you are influenced by some uh, masks here. How about the uh, the El Camino mask? Yeah, that's that's my response to the to that mask too. The Corvette mask. You like frogs? Nope, you are indifferent on frogs. How about uh is this weird? If I cosplay as you in front of you? I found him. The green hat boy. He's using this place as a Zetra. Came to the shop last night and I followed him. Yep, okay. We're... Well, this seems like the creepiest way to play, so I'm gonna do that. Yeah, there we go. That's That's some creepy stuff. Can we get a little bit closer to the rock for the kid? There we go. That's... <laughs> that's... That's perfectly creepy. Digging that greatly. Um... Let's... Let's go ahead and play the song in double time here. This should make it 6 p.m., which is exactly the time we need it to be. <sighs> but, uh, I'm nervous. What if it moves me? What if it moves me in an inconvenient way? Return to normal? Who doesn't want to be normal? I don't know what normal is like, but I've heard good things about it. Okay, I'm just gonna hang out right here. We'll let time move at the speed of one second per second. Which, as I understand it, is a pretty good time speed. If you're a fan of the passage of time, let me know in the comments. <laughs> Actually, come to think of it, the older I get, the less and less a fan I am of the passage of time. So, I expect <laughs> such a call to action will uh, result in precious few comments. If you are a fan, or if you are not a fan of the unrelenting passage of time, you're uh, watching me play the right game, that's for sure. Okay, Sakone. I see a Sakone in the distance. Hopping, skipping, and winking. All 12 pixels of him. Oh look, he's at least 18 pixels now. Where is he getting all these pixels from? It's incredible. Yeah, once uh once the next event kicks off, then I'll uh, slow time back down. Once we get this cutscene here, all right. Vamanos! And Fua camera! Follow! Wahoo, we're in there! And... Alright, let's slow time, and let's do some puzzle solving, shall we? With just a mild amount of, uh, time pressure. Ugh! Okay, hang on. Did I... does this... am I... Oh, no. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> okay, so that's borked. Um, all right, so we got a letter here. Is it too late to deliver the letter? Um, night three. Required event. Okay, let's see. Yeah, in the same cycle. So you have to do the entire quest twice. Bring the letter to the post office at 6 p.m. Okay, so let's, uh, let's slow down time here. Uh. Hopefully I can deliver the letter and at least do this half. Slow the flow! Alright, so we'll have to... 
All right, and now let's head back into town. Deliver the letter that we got. We're apparently doing the other one. <laughs> the other half of the quest here. Uh, bring the letter to the post office at 6 p.m. Give it to the postman and he'll have to deliver it. No choice. Obligation. Neither rain nor sleet no, nor s snail. No, or something. No snails. West clock down. Okay, good. What is... Okay. We, uh, hello, sir. I have a, a task for you. Oh, I want to flee, but it's not written on the schedule. To, to me, the delivery schedule is the highest priority. Tell me about it. This is a priority mail seal. This is the highest of priorities. I shall deliver it. And in order to keep up with the... achingly slow man, I shall put on the bunny hood. Follow him to the latte milk bar. After a bit, he'll come out and stand near the exit. Are you gonna... What you doing, friend? Are you grabbing your... Huh? <laughs> Neat. Okay. Quick change! Way to go. Good job, friend. Can I do such a thing? Aw, oh, pity. Okay. That's a good shuffling. You're dragging your feet, though, a little bit, friend. You gotta... You gotta... Raise those knees! Just wasting energy if you drag your feet like that. And slam the door in my face. There we go. You know, he's just, uh, he's pacing himself. He's got to run all day every day. You know, you gotta... And plus, he's on a very tight schedule. He can't be, he can't be late or early. Throw everything off if he did that. Where's Mr. Man? He's in my left ear. There we go. That's right, his race, his pace. He's in control. Stand near the exit for a short moment before running away from town. Where'd you go? There you are. Speak to him to get the postman's hat. Okay, so I have to go in with him. Got it. Well. Yeah, it's, uh... <laughs> There's a uh, there's a healthy dose of waiting happening <laughs> here, but gotta do what you gotta do. As I understand it, the 3DS version is better in that regard, as you're able to have a little bit more granular control over the uh, flow of time. But this ain't the 3DS. This is the OG N64 version on an OG N64. Waiting with Dave. That's the that's the name of the game here. There we go. We even got some music. Letter to Mammy. Yeah. On today's episode, we wait and then we wait some more. And after we wait, yet more waiting. Yes, the, the wrong buttons will happen, that's for sure. I have a delivery for you, postmistress. Oh my, it can't be. You're still here. To, to, to tomorrow's delivery is still scheduled. What are you saying? Did you see the sky? It's terrible. But, but... Oh my, well, what shall we do? It's from Cafe. <laughs> yeah, it's priority mail. Hey, I'm so happy to think something good would come in the end. Thank you. You flee now. That's an order. Save yourself. Understood. Bye. All right, what do I have to do here? Is there... What's the next action? 
Um, after a bit, he'll come out and stand near the exit for a short moment. Speak to him to get the postman's hat. All right, so we got to get a hat from this fella. Can we get it now? I would like to speak. Nope, not attack. Well, I'm waiting for you to do that. What's your... Come on now. Where's your speak box? There it is. Oh dear, are you all right with not fleeing? It looks like this is it for the town, you know. You saw the moon, didn't you? It's gotten so huge. I think you'll find it's the same size, it's just closer. Perspective, am I right? Gosh, what's the deal? All the townsfolk have fled. You should flee too, far away. Yeah, okay, fine. I will stalk the postman just a little bit longer. Slam the door in my face, thank you. And now, speak to me. <laughs> Are we... Am I not allowed to speak? Ooh boy, that's quite the pace on you. How do I... Where is the speak? There it is. I have decided to flee. It is an order from the postmaster. I am now free! I can set my own schedule! I don't need this anymore, so here. I'll let you have it. Wahoo! Uh, we got the Mario cap. I mean the postman's hat. This is digni This dignified hat allows you to check the mail. Use C to put it on. It might just suit ya. You saved a troubled public servant. <laughs> oh, the prance, though. That's a lovely prance. I mean, you're gonna take the guard's head off with that kind of arc, but... It's fine. Can we... Okay, we're just gonna clip through him on our way out of town here. Any, uh... I think he's gone. I think he has uh, evaporated into the ether. Evaporated postman. Yep, alright. Good on you, sir. That's another mask. Only one mask remains. Let's, uh, let's check a post box thing here. You are doing a great job, ka -ching. Thanks. Some other item than a letter has been deposited. ka -ching. Oh, dang. Piece of heart. Digging that. Nice work. Thanks. I took the postman's heart piece. I'm sure he won't mind. I don't know who left that tip for him, but quite generous, has to be said. You're doing a great job. Some other item. It's a... It's, it's a green rupee. Nice work. I suppose, you know... It was a tip. No one, no one had to do that, but they did. Oh no! I walked too close to the uh, the cutscene, the cutscene box. Okay, postman's hat. Night three, four thirty in the final. It's only a return to the stockpot in. If you if you save the sun's mask, do the ceremony. Do the thing. All right, so the sun's mask is so okay so the sun's mask i think is the final mask okay so at the end cafe will get back the sun mask he will then run back to town uh you don't need to acquire the sun's mask with cafe to complete this part of the quest go to the milk bar in East Clocktown, speak to Madame Aroma. Oh, there's a bottle opportunity here. Let's, uh, there's a bottle tunity that we can take advantage of. And we're gonna, with the uh, cafe's mask. Okay. Gonna put on the clown, f clown face, cow face, sorry. Clowns and cows are, uh, different entities, believe it or not. 
Latte? Latte only milk bar. Okay, so I gotta wait for ten. And then I can get a heart... or no, a bottle. Uh, go to the milk bar, and next to the inn, you'll need the Romani mask. Speak to Madame Aroma while wearing Cafe's mask. A special delivery letter. I may have missed my opportunity. Well, I don't know. Let's find out. Once the clock strikes ten, I think we'll have done everything we can do here. Okay, yeah. So if you if you saved the sun's mask, okay, so that's that's the fork in the road. You can either save the sun's mask or you can deliver the letter. We delivered the letter, so can't do both. We we borked <laughs> the other one, so we did this one. Uh, ah, you are a member. Please come in. We 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 made a bork of it, but we recovered. We made use of this time loop at least. Sir, it's the rules. Where's your speak box? There it is. Oh dear, you're the one searching for Cafe. How is it? Have you found him? Do I still have the letter? No, I don't. I delivered it. Hmm. How do we extract this heart piece out of you? Okay, I see. Alright, gotcha. So yeah, I think this... Have a cow mask. And what does that have to do with anything? <laughs> oh dear, is that so? You haven't found him. Well, that's enough. Good work. Now you flee too. Um, I'm reminded... Can I get to... Uh, I want to... Just, we can do one more thing with this time loop here. It's the final night, and as I understand it, a whole heap of people are waiting over at the ranch. So I think... I am gonna go check out the ranch. See what shakes there. We got time. We've done everything we can do on this loop, so that's fine. I think I'm gonna need powder keg here. Oh, of all places, say you can carry a powder keg, right? Fitty money, I'll buy it, Char. Wow. Powder kegs made by my instructor are extremely powerful. Alright, let's, uh... Let's perform the drum solo of fast travel here. And head to the ranch. Head ranch word, anyway. Milk road, yep. Kind of a bummer there's no owl statue in the ranch proper, but well, we'll make do. If the rock is removed We'll have spent money on a powder keg for no reason, but that's fine. Money is ephemeral. If <laughs> ephemeral. Hey, you did it, man. Way to go. I opened the way. Indeed you did. Would you say that to a child? I opened the way. You would. All right, let's see. Uh, let's, let's walk a little faster, shall we? Vroom! We put our fast pedal on. Ten PM on the final night. I hear horses. Where is everyone? Can I go dog racing? Is that a thing I could do at this time? Oof boy. Oh boy, oh boy. That's 
That's a big, that's the biggest peekaboo. Ooh, uh. Ranch opens at six. I bet it doesn't. It's locked. Yeah, the 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 world is ending. Let's uh, let's gamble. <laughs> Why not? Money has no meaning at the end of the world. Perfect time to gamble. Okay, I thought people were gonna be here, but I don't see people. Not in here. Okay, all the doors are locked. I just gotta gamble. Is that so much to ask? I got 71 money. I'm just burning a hole in my tunic. I got a fever and the only prescription is more gambling. This and other things that only healthy people say. Brought to you by the good Dave. All right, I guess, uh... Ooh, boy. Ooh, boy. All right, well, we got the postman's hat. The only remaining mask is the sun's mask, which we can no longer get in this time loop. Um... Or the, I guess the only remaining mask is the couple's mask, specifically. Um... But we can't get that. Um, yeah, and once we get the couple's mask, we'll have all of the masks. Which will enable us to get the fierce deity, the cool ranch deity mask. That's right. Um, okay, I think there's nothing, nothing left but to reboot time here. And we're gonna do it! We're gonna do the other branch of this quest here. Save and return to dawn of the first day. Heck. Let's do it. This is a more climactic order to be doing these events in anyway, so I'm alright with it. We also had a fish in one of our bottles, and I don't know where that fish went just now. <laughs> that that fish is now stuck in time somewhere, I think. Yep. <laughs> no, no idea where that fish went. I bet that fish itself has no idea either. Alright, let's see. First things first, 10 a.m. Mayor's residence. Making that happen. And I think... Um, can we get in here? If we... If we Deku, can we get in upstairs? Does the upstairs door ever lock? Alright. Hooray! It's open! Alright, so let's find, uh... Let's go downstairs and find Grammy. And I believe... She's right here. Okay, and... Oh, Tortoise! Let me advance time by two hours! Okay... I think this will help. It is eight. Oh, are you awake? What's the, uh, ten to twelve? All right. Yes, let's try again right now. Speed up time. Uh, another two hours. That'll help. All right, it is ten. Let's head to the mayor's. Using the fast mask. Vroom, vroom. It's 11 already, heck. And if I remember right, 
on second thought, this isn't even strictly necessary because we already have Cafe's mask. Gorman. Okay, let's see. What's the next? I think. Okay, so we have Cafe's mask ready, so this isn't strictly required. Let's, uh, let's break time and, uh, talk to her using the mask that she gave us in another timeline. It has been some time. Carnival of time. It's about time! Meaning, the opening performance I've asked you to do. Ah, yes. They've canceled. Just now. ha wa wa what Allow me to explain. Oh, excuse me, I am to work at this year's show. Well, that was the plan. Toto. Bless the rains. He arrived this morning. Great Bay, unusual incident. Why? Why? Details. Any rate, cancel a performance. See? This means... Job is... Off! We're, we're speed running in the dialogue here, because we've uh, done this in our previous stream. Because what should I, I mean the Gorman troop, do? Oh, Gorman, I wish it was only your face that was annoying me right now. Sick burn, loving it. Alright, what's the next required event here? Optional event, optional event, required event, day one at 1.50. Um, uh, well, let's see, let's get the... Okay, this makes it easier, at least. Required event 2. See, irrelevant cutscene. Wear the Goron mask anytime before 350. Alright. Let's get out of here and let's get there. Prior to... Oops. I got shoved out. Oof. Sir, you're in my doorway. Thank you. Uh. Uh, yes. I am a Goron. That's... Hey, there we go. It's a good Dave stream. We hit some wrong buttons. There we go. All right, we're good. Anytime before 3.50, eh? Uh... Turn to the counter, wear the Goron mask. She'll give me the room key. Furthermore, able to stockpot in from the front door after hours. Lovely. Can enter the stockpot in anytime. Okay. Worth doing. On the basis of getting the, the convenience key, I guess we can call it. Um, once the cooking is over. Required event number three, day one at 2.10. 2.10 to 8. Okay. So then we hang out here. And... We wait for... There you are. Welcome, smack, to the stockpot inn. Did you have a, uh, a reservation? Oh, you have a reservation. That's good. Mr. Uh, Frank, is it? One moment, please. Mr. Frank, I have you down for an afternoon arrival. Your room is the knife chamber on the second floor. Wahoo, got the key. Please relax. Please relax, and don't think about your mortality. Whatever you do, don't think about your impending doom. I think this is my room. My quote-unquote room. Some free muns. Wahoo, I'm pretty happy. Ain't I just. Alright, that is a helpful thing. After the postman delivers... Postman, have you delivered? Oof. Pardon me. 
You've delivered. Okay, Cafe's Mask. You're also looking for Cafe. Smack! I have a request. Cafe, I have a clue that'll help you find him. Tonight at 11.30, please come to our kitchen. We'll talk then. Alright, is that, in fact, the next required thing? Uh, yep, that is, that is the next step. We hang out in the kitchen, and we wait. And I do believe the kitchen is the, uh, room with the, uh, the oven, the stove in it. The stove and the plates, and the onions. Those are some luscious looking onions. Hang on a second, I need to... Them's are some purely inspirational ovens. Uh, ovens. Onions. There we go. And... Snap. Keep that picture? Oh yeah. That's an onion picture for all time. Uh, is this Granny's room? We can accelerate time a little bit. Gotta wait until 11.30. Oh, tortoise. Uh, Carnival of Time. Fasting forward at two hours per second. Beautiful. It is now five. I just love the Carnival of Time story so much. It's my favorite story to fall asleep to. Are you awake? I guess that story was a little boring. It is seven. We can do a couple more of those. Oh, Tortoise, you're late. Tomorrow is another early day, so good night. I'll read you a story tomorrow. Interesting. There's a, uh... Okay. So she'll, uh... She, she's been... She's bored herself to sleep, I think, with her storytelling. I am no longer allowed to uh, use her as a means of accelerating the flow of time. The last time we were here, we absconded with some fish. We'll be sure to not do that again, especially because we didn't do anything with the fish when we got it. We just kept it in our pocket and then lost it during some time travel. Who knows where and or when that fish is anymore, but heck. At least we have a picture of an onion. Am I right? <clears throat> Let's see, we need, uh, what do we, what do we need here? I think all we need, meet with Anju in the kitchen of the inn to get the letter. Uh, warning, must not give any letters to bar inside the toilet. <laughs> That's right, forgot about the toilet. How could we forget about the toilet? Okay, so we just meet her at midnight. Glass slippers and all. Um, we get the letter. And put the letter inside. Night one or day two. Deposit the letter. And then day two at three in the afternoon. Is when we intercept... Uh, cafe and explore his hideout. All right, great. So I, I have a perfect, crystal clear understanding of all what must be done here. I'm just gonna stand here, smelling your onions. Hope you don't mind. That's not even a euphemism. I mean that literally. I'm just gonna be, I'm literally gonna be standing here, sniffing an onion until midnight. That's, that's. That's, that's the best kind of date night, I think. Grab your partner and sniff some onions until midnight. <laughs> yep, that is indeed one of the things that was ever said. Ever. <laughs> if you're feeling extra romantic, substitute onion for garlic. <clears throat> A whole lot of it, too. Needs to be at least a similar amount of garlic by weight. If you have a, uh, uh, a, uh, if you're, if you have an onion that weighs approximately 420 grams, you need at least 69 grams of garlic. 
Them's the rules. I don't make them up. That's just... That's how the world works. We know this. I'm here indoors. I have to stop smelling this onion soon, but... Gosh, I'm just enjoying it so much. Unironically, though, I do love a good onion. I could eat onions like apples. Like, <laughs> just give me a good, a uh, good white onion, and I'll just take a bite out of it like it's an apple. It's, I just, I love onions, much to my wife's chagrin, of course. But <laughs> it's, I, uh, we, we stand onions here at the Good Dave Channel. Garlic is, of course, superior in every way, but onions aren't bad either. Onions can hold their own, that's for sure. I'm sorry to trouble you late at night. It's about him. Cafe. I received a letter from him. Strange, isn't it? Getting a letter from a missing person. But there's absolutely no mistaking it's from him. It's clear to me. Smack! Please, or I'll headbutt you into a fine paste again. Here's my letter. Please put this in a post box. When this is delivered, when he receives my letter, you should be able to meet him. Please tell him that Anju is waiting for him. And please, after you've seen him, tell me how he looked. He's looking young as ever, let's say. I'm scared. I I can't go. Can I ask this of you? Smack! Thank you very much. In my culture, we show gratitude by headbutting people. You were given a letter to Cafe Wahoo. To a mailbox. Smack! God, that's three in one conversation. Please mail it immediately, in the morning. She is profusely... Uh, <laughs> uh, gracious. Profusely thankful for my assistance in this quest. So much so that she's delivered three swift headbutts to our face. Ah, that's right, the snoozy Goron. Sorry, friend. <laughs> At least it's a nice night. Or so you say. Um, letter to cafe. I don't think, I think I can deliver this now, right? There's no, I don't need to wait. Um, required event. Go to any mailbox and put the letter inside. Night one or day two. Yeah, it's all good. Just deliver it. Deposit mail here. Wah ba ba your letter has been received. It shall be delivered tomorrow. Okay, lovely. Uh, we can accelerate time to the morning. Dawn of the second day. We need to wait until three. Three ten to three fifty. Time has passed. Yep, we no longer have the letter. That's for true. We don't have the letter, but we do have a photo of an onion. And in the end, that's what really matters. Alright, Grammy. Tell me my favorite story. Precisely four times. Carnival of Time! Snooze! Oh, are you awake? Believe it or not. Can I... Are you... Did you... There we go. Okay, couldn't... Couldn't find the speak box. Uh, story... Carnival of Time. It's just my favorite. Oh, were you awake? Oh, tortoise. Carnival of time. I just love the story so much, I can't sleep without it. Guess that story was something something. Um, we can... We can do another. Uh... No, I'll tell you what. I don't want to cut it too close. We gotta be there during the three o'clock hour. If we're there early, that's not too much waiting. 
I can handle that. The rain will help. Okay. Look at me go! Vroom vroom! See, it's already one! Uh, let's collect this fairy for no reason. Or let's not. It's also fine. Tell you what let's do. This should work. Indeed it do. Please, please me. I want to hold your hand. Anna. Uh, and now become as stone. I don't know if this is necessary, but couldn't hurt. And now we face the camera in the creepiest of ways. And as a matter of fact, uh, yeah, no, I was, I was gonna take a break here, but no, nah, it's fine. Um, oh heck, but I'll go into my spiel though. Uh, pretty soon, I'm gonna take my first break of the stream. I'm gonna stand up, stretch my legs, get some water. If you're able to do any of these things, I recommend that you do, because your body loves them all really very much. Um, if this is your first time here, this is very much what we do. We play beloved old games for the first time, and we enjoy the heck out of them. So if that sounds like your bag, I recommend a like, a follow, subscribe, etc. It's fast and free, and it'll keep you connected for our future retro gaming shenanigans. We're finishing up Majora's Mask today. I've loved it. It's been a great time, but all good things must come to an end. Um, we're doing Anju and Cafe's quest. Um, we've already gotten... The, the, the doing this quest will get us the final mask, which is exciting. Um, and then we'll get the, uh, what's it? The Cool Ranch Deity Mask. <laughs> um, and then we'll beat the game. Wow! Um, and then that's our, that's on our plate today. But after, after Majora's Mask, what are we moving on to? I think, I think we're moving on to Earthbound. I think it's time for an Earthbound stream here. An Earthbound stream, or 12, <laughs> however long it takes me to, to beat the game. Never played Earthbound before, despite all of my profuse Earthbound references that I used throughout the stream. We're gonna do the thing. But we gotta beat Majora first, and that's what we're gonna do. Alright, I'm gonna... Do I have to be wearing anything to talk to Cafe here? We've, uh, snuck into his house. Nope. This is where we just simply wait for him to return and give him a stern talking to. We're gonna stand on his bed while we wait. Like a, uh... Like a real guest does. That's some polite stuff there. Hello, friend. Speak to me! Green hat, green clothes, that's right. Alright, we are gonna take that break that I was talking about. Um, enjoy the kitten photos while I'm away. And when we come back, we're gonna keep on wrapping this up. Oh, it's gonna be fun. Hang tight.
Yeah, everybody, we are back. Thank you for waiting. That break was uh, slightly extended, but that's fine, because we're here now. Let's make things happen. Green hat, green clothes. Andrew wrote about you in her letter. It seems you are looking for cafe. Can you keep a secret? Nope. Andrew trusted you. I shall also trust you. Egads! I am cafe. The cafe we're looking for is an adult. When I look at you, I just see a child. Hello, everybody. Hello, Evan and Sylvie. Sivvy. I can't. I'm an old man. My eyes. It's fine. <laughs> uh, I was turned into this by a strange imp wearing a mask, but I'm not hiding because I look this way. When I was turned into this, I went to see the great fairy in the shrine near the north gate, but on the way, my precious mask... A wedding ceremony mask was stolen from me by some prancing man with a grinning face. <laughs> That's right. Tattle is brutal. That's that. <laughs> the name should not be Tattle. The name should be Brutal. That's that's harsh. Before my wedding ceremony, I was quite happy. I was targeted because of what I had been turned into. <laughs> the shit. I know Anju is worried, but I can't go out yet. I made a promise to her that I would bring the wedding mask and, and greet her. This pendant. Give it to Anju. Yeah, though you may not understand these grown-up matters. Keep what we just talked about a secret from everyone. That's right. It is a secret from everyone. Can I... I have one of those too, you know. Things that get stolen in this town always make their way to the curiosity shop. Stand on that crate and peek into the hole. We did that uh, on our last stream. How about this? Can I... Do I get anything? Can I cosplay as you in front of you? Nope. You are nonplussed. Alright, that's fine. We must take the pendant to Anju. Using our speediest legs. We gotta put our fast legs on. Neum. Hmm, that's not very fast. Look at us go. It's like we're part greyhound. I suppose we might be. We don't know. We don't know. <laughs> we, we, we haven't done a... Uh, What's the, what is the DNA test called? Uh, 
<laughs> for some reason, the only thing coming to mind is Forever 21. But that's not right. They don't do DNA tests. That's that's something else entirely. Uh, oh, did you meet him? As a matter of fact. Boy, heck, there we go. We got the pendant. Smack. It's from Cafe. Thank you. And now she'll stay. I have decided to wait for him. I've made my promise. I'm fine with this. I, I believe him. All right, let's go back to the checklist and make sure we are still on track. I do believe the next required thing. Um, we we went to the curiosity shop at midnight the last time, so we've seen that cutscene. Interesting, though. Uh, required event day three at noon. All right, let's make that happen. Let's make it happen, Captain. We'll be right where we uh, picked up at the start of the stream. Uh, day three. So it's... Okay, we're good. We're good! Song of Double Time. Night of the second day. I think this is only going to fast forward time one hour. <laughs> so... Whoosh! Yep. That was, uh quite the time warp we did there. Let's do the time warp again. There it is. Dawn of the final day. Digging that. And then we gotta wait for, th uh, for noon. So we gotta kill a little bit of time. And I know just the grandmother to uh, help us pass time here. Um, we're gonna need the money mask, and we're eventually gonna need the stone mask. Whoosh! Neum! Downshift into cornbread. Let's get this happening here. <laughs> Those are just three words. Three unrelated words. Oh, tortoise, are you ready? Oh, okay. So we can't do our usual shenanigans. Are you ready? It's been a long time since we've had a picnic in Romani Ranch, hasn't it? Poor thing. Well, I say that. She's not actually senile. She pretends to be senile. For the sake of not eating bad cooking. I'm sure she knows exactly what's going on. Alright, so we hang out here until noon. Okay, and we can put on the stone mask. Nada. It's locked! Alright, and then we wait. Alright, this feels familiar. It's almost as if we were, uh... in exactly this position. Nearly an hour ago. It's fine. This mask has such a... a South Park kind of appeal to it that it's really off-putting for me. <laughs> I, am, I am not a... I... I... I am... I have zero percent <laughs> appreciation for for South Park. I am very much actively anti-South Park, if I'm honest. Yeah, I never actually... I never got the stone mask um, in time to actually use it for the stuff it's good for. <laughs> Apparently it makes it so easy to just sneak past all of the, uh, for instance, the the Gerudo pirates in the pirate hideout. If I'd have had this mask before I did that, 
That would have just trivialized that entire part of the game. <laughs> Don't have to worry about getting caught by any of the pirates at all. But, oh well, we made do without it. No solicitors. Okay, so this actually does belong to... Okay, so this is actually... This isn't like... This isn't, strictly speaking, Cafe's place. Ooh, uh, peekaboo. This is the curiosity shop. This is like... This is the back entrance to the curiosity shop. The employee-only entrance, I guess you could say, to the curiosity shop. So it does makes sense that the curiosity shop owner would be here. Thinking of it as Cafe's house <laughs> it made it very disturbing to find the curiosity shop owner here, but... Tisn't the case. It's 10 o'clock. Still locked. How about you, Mr. Froggy friend? Are you in the mood? Or a fancy mask? Ah, Don Jero, it's been so long. Who has brought you all this way? Could it be you came all this way looking for me? Ah, uh, you need not say a thing upon seeing that face. I understand. Is it true that I heard that it was still winter in the mountains? When spring comes, I shall Definitely go to the mountains, so let us meet again. Toodles, Frogo. Alright. The appar apparently so, so there are five frogs that can be reunited. Um, I did not reunite the frog choir, because apparently So there's the see if I can remember them. This is one of them, obviously. Another one appears after you thaw out the Goron village. I'm forgetting where another one is, but the remaining two that I definitely don't forget are um, dungeon mini-bosses that, upon being defeated, turn into frogs. So it's an extraordinary amount of work <laughs> to, to reunite all five frogs. Um, you have to do... You have to do three dungeons <laughs> to do it. Um, and your reward for all of that work is... A heart piece. Yeah, that's just not... <laughs> I'm okay. <laughs> I'm alright. <laughs> just takes less time to... Uh, collect three fairies in my, uh, in my bottles here. And I might even be able to collect a fourth bottle. Um, in this time loop. Ah, that's true. There is a uh, a frog song that can be heard. Hadn't thought about that. Oh wait, we're waiting for three o'clock, aren't we? I think we are. I thought we were waiting for noon, but in fact we're waiting for three. Um, required event day three. No, twelve to six. Okay, we're fine. It's locked! It was... Um, let's see if it actually needs to be 1 o'clock and we can just walk in. Because it was 1 o'clock last time. Yeah, it just needs to be 1. Okay, so the ZeldaDungeon.net is slightly inaccurate in that regard. 12 doesn't work, but 1 does. Huh? You the green hat kid. Now, Cafe, he says he wants you to take this to his mother. We got the... we got the letter to Mammy. He goes running after the guy. The guy's a regular, greedy thief named Sacone. Alright, so we are back where we picked up just an hour ago. Uh, so let's see here. Now... Found the owner, got the mask. Just after 6 p.m. All right, let's uh, head to the canyon. 
and let's not beef this one again. <laughs> the the crucial error we made was that uh, uh, Ikana Canyon. There we go. We tried. We made it inside Sakone's hideout, and we tried to slow down time, but we couldn't because we were inside a place. So we left the hideout to try to slow down time, but of course, doing so resulted in the, the hideout becoming closed again behind us. So we we uh, <laughs> we beefed that time loop, but it's fine because there are two things you can do. So we simply did the other thing. Whoosh! Splish, splash, I was falling real far. Tattle tells me there's a secret hidey guy. Are you a friend or foe? You are a friend. Speak to me. Doing business in the canyon. The place is cursed. If you don't have something that drives away demons, they'll catch you. Rumor has it, demons aren't afraid unless they see something that looks the same as themselves. Ooh, heck, don't you need any blue potion in case you get cursed? Oh, one drink is a hundred rupees. Do you need any? Nah, it's fine. Oh, really? You'll be cursed! Yeah, I know. Uh, it's, I've been cursed a long time, don't worry about it. Cafe! I found him, Green Hat Boy. He's using this place as his safe house for keeping his stolen goods. Apparently his name is Sakone. He came to the shop last night and I followed him. His storage for things he's stolen is on the other side of this rock door. Only Sakone can open it. The only way in is to wait for Sakone to arrive. I'll wait. I've made a promise to Andrew. He will show up. Oh, he will. We know this. And, uh, not only will he, will he show up, but this time, I'll go ahead and not beef. <laughs> not beef this timeline. Say, around 5 o'clock. I'll, uh, I'll slow down time. And everything will be fine. Did you know, Cafe? You got a fan club. I'll wait. Can I? What can I? What can I? Ooh, I got a. Oh, sorry. Sneeze coming on. That's a good sneeze button. All right, let's try to not assault Cafe here. We're just trying to. There we go. Hashtag twinning. Can I put my knife away? This is... There we go. <laughs> this is slightly inappropriate. Well, this is worse. Alright, we'll just look at this until five. This isn't disturbing, even slightly. Oof. Yikes on bikes, fam. Well, I guess it's only fitting for a game like this to be so, so severely off-putting. I kind of want a mask like this in real life. One that just glitches in and out of existence in front of my face. But only if you're really, really close, invading my personal space. And then the disturbing thing happens, and people are repelled. It is fine, let's make time slower. Inverted. Slow that flow. We'll extend our wait a little bit for uh, Sakone's arrival, but that's fine because at least time will be slower for the uh, the puzzle dungeon. Let's see if I can can I replicate the horrifying thing. 
inching closer. Ooh, there it is. Gosh. And clip that mask. Ooh, uh. I can just keep getting closer and closer. How close dare I get? Man, even when it's not glitching out, this is a creepy mask. <laughs> not a fan. Yeah. Stop being so weird and creepy. Oof. I like how the uh, hair changes color depending on the angle you're looking at. <laughs> sometimes it's purple, sometimes it's blonde. I wonder if any other masks have a similar... What's another... Uh, oh, this should be frightening. Okay. I mean, it is frightening, but it, in, this, is, this is what it should look like. So, <laughs> while frightening, it, it is... It, it looks as intended. Which is... Ooh, uh, no shortage of off-putting stuff here. Uh, okay. That's, yeah, I'm, I'm crying too. Ain't no doubt. Oh, gosh. <laughs> That's real. <laughs> That's some real terrifying stuff right there. I just, I live inside the sad man's chin. Ooh, ah, uh, boy, okay. What else can I, what's another? Here we go, the El Camino mask. Oof. <laughs> Uh, this is another example of like this looks horrifying, but that's just that's that's what it's supposed to look like. <laughs> that's, that's it looks as intended. E yikes! A little bit of glitching, but that's not the worst part. <laughs> of course, my my mouth occasionally appearing through the mask is none too uh, none too unsettling. On the plus side, I can dance. This game has a dance button. It has an explode button. It's got it all. Those are the only two buttons you need in a video game. You just need a dance button and an explode button. Everything else is superfluous. I'm trying to think if there are any games where those are the only two things you can do. And honestly, Journey comes to mind, but there's, 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 it's a bit of a stretch to call it an explode button. A dance button, sure. An explode button, though. Not quite. You just, you don't need any more verbs than that in your video game. If you can, once you can dance and when you, once you can explode, you got it all. Even if you're just making like a, you know, a sports simulator, like you're making FIFA or something. Forget about all of the, you know, real stuff that football people do. You can just, you can just give them dance and explode buttons and the game will be just as fun. <laughs> and some would argue even more fun. Give me Madden, but with a dance and explode button modded in. Is Mr. Man going to appear? There's Mr. Man. I'm going to put on the stone mask. Just in case. Probably doesn't do anything, but couldn't hurt, that's for sure. I do believe it's cutscene time. Oopa, okay. In 
any second now. <laughs> Cafe briefly uh, uh, just blinked out of existence there. Ain't no thing. Up. All right. In we get. Let's do it for real this time. We got a dungeon. Smashing some pots? Nope. Unsmashable. Ooh. All right. Here we get. We're trapped. Ah. Oh. It's the sun's mask. Now I've done it. You sure have, friend. Oh, no. Step on that switch. What? Are you, <laughs> are you telling us what to do? It's uh, some setup where the door stays open only while the switch is pressed. Bonk. There we go. Oh, now I am cafe. Okay. There should be some device in this room that also opens the door. Oh, uh, the mask! Is this gonna... He's trying to pull it out of our reach and make his escape. We've got a horror. Oh my. Okay, hang on a second. Fortunately, this ain't Dark Souls. We got a, uh, we got a pause button. Make sure I do this right. I do love me a puzzle, but I also don't want to mess this up. It takes quite a lot of work to get here. Uh, push a block onto the blue switch. Defeat the Baba. That's no good. This isn't the switch. Go check that room. There should be some sort of mechanism. Please, there's no time. I don't like. <laughs> Why don't you like him? He's fine. I mean, I suppose it, he does seem connected with some thieves, but <laughs> you know, is there a choice? Should we help him? Not moving ahead in the face of danger when you know it's for the better is just like tail. That's it. Let's go. Be wapado, and get sliced. Hooray! Okay, let's see here. Time pressure. Two real, five me. Avoid the red sp switches as it speeds up. Okay. Step on the yellow switches to slow down the conveyor. Step on the yellow. That's some, uh... Oh, I see here. Ooh, okay. Do I just have to hit this? Oh, okay. <laughs> That's also fine. Gotta collect some muns for our trubs, though. Yet more babs. Get debabbed. Slow down. Okay. And then do I just push a thing onto the yellow switch here? Oh, Zelda dungeon. Briefly step on the red block and push the large block so that it's sitting on the yellow. Okay, so... Bre uh, oh, I see. Gotcha. So a little bit of red is required here. And then... There we go. And tell you what we're gonna do. We're gonna get Big Slice in here. Come on now. Alright. Two shot. 
Oh no. Oh no, what have I... <laughs> Hang on a second. <laughs> did I... Did I do a bad? I don't know if I can... Can I pull? Let's see if I can pull a block. Maybe I can pull. Whoop. My bad. It's fine. Okay, you can pull. Good, good, good. Ra uh, come on now. There we go. All right. And reach the door, step on the switch, and Link also must step on switch. Ba -ba -da -ba. I got the sun's mask back! Wahoo! You helped, Cafe! This was added to your notebook. There's still time! I must get back to town. There is still time. Would you like the bunny hood mask to accelerate your tiny little feet? Bye, I guess. <laughs> All right. Oh my. We got the uh, the clock of death here. Uh, I'm at the end. Cafe. We'll get the sun mask. Uh, then run back to town, soar over to Clock Town. Uh, after 6 p.m. Uh, you don't need to require... Okay, go to the milk bar. And for, uh, let's see. Follow him... No, 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 no. What's the next step here? When there is only 1.30 left, return to the Stockpot Inn. Enter the employee's only room. If you save the sun's mask, it'll appear with just over an hour left. All right. Um. Okay, so let's... Let's Vamanos here. Let's do the big Vamanos fam. I can... Uh, I can... I can get a bottle right now, I think. That is a thing what can be done. Uh, I didn't get the letter. Oh no, that is a letter. Okay. That looked like a... That didn't look like a letter, but it's fine. Uh, the second time... I think I can deliver this... Deliver it myself. Okay. Let's... Let's do that. Let's deliver it myself. Fine. <laughs> I'll show proof of membership. Is it really that important right now? Ah, you are a member. Please come in. Boy, this is some eerie music. I'm spooked. Speak. Ah, oh, dear. Are you all right with not fleeing? It looks like this is it for this town, you know. You saw the moon, didn't you? It's gotten so big. All the townsfolk have fled. You should flee, too. Uh, far away. But I have a thing. Oh, that's right. I have to wear Cafe's mask. And now... Speak to me. There it is. Her speak box is so small. Oh, dear. You're the one searching for Cafe. How is it? Have you found him? Wouldn't you know? Wrong buttons. There we go. It's a good Dave stream. Oh dear. 
priority mail. This, it's from Cafe, correct? Correct? Wonderful, you really are an expert. Yes, yes, I'm sorry, my thanks. Yes, yes, it is your job after all. Bottle, Chateau Romani. Mm. The drink even boosts your magic stamina. Swirl it around with your tongue to enjoy its flavor to the fullest. Mmm. Tastes pasteurized. Wahoo! I'm sorry, at this point in time I can give you only something like this. I actually wanted to give this to you sooner. Really? Thanks. Alright. Fourth bottle acquired. Now it's time to... Head to the employees only room over here. Which I believe is. No, this is, uh, this is Grammy's room. And she ain't here. Employee's room is upstairs, I think. Watch me go. I think this is it. Ooh, the atmosphere is so thick, you cut it with a knife. I have decided to wait for him. I've made my promise. And let's just double check to make sure I am doing what I need to be doing. 4.30, enter the employee's only room. If you save the sun mask, he will appear at the end with a little, just a sliver of time left. They'll give us the uh, couple's mask. All right, I am in the, I am in the right place at the right time. I've made my promise. I'm fine with this. I believe him. Time to get a good look at this, because it's never, I, it's not been okay. So this is. The first time when I saw this in the cutscenes, uh, last time we played, I thought this was just a silent person standing in the room. I didn't realize this was a mannequin. <laughs> now that I realize this is a mannequin, <laughs> everything makes a lot more sense. Is this a mannequin? Or is this actually... No, yeah, this is a mannequin, right? Okay, well, either way. If this is a person, they've been standing still for a real long time. Alright, I'm just gonna stand here and clip through your vase, hope you don't mind. Just doing, just doing Link things. That's how we do around these parts. If I can't break pots, I'll at least clip through them. I'm, I'm, I'm interested in pilfering the contents of that chest, but also, uh, I just, this, this all feels very fragile. I don't want to like, I don't want to, I don't want to interact with anything in case, uh, it breaks everything. Cause, uh, completing this quest, a lot of steps and be ashamed to, be ashamed to beef it. It's all fine. All right. We're going to, we're going to trust chat on this one. We're going to open it. Muns. Yeah, I'm pretty happy. It's okay. Money doesn't have... It has no meaning anymore at the end of the world. <laughs> Remember that, boys and girls. Money has no meaning at the end of the world. A crucial lesson. Do I still have my, uh... Yes, this is the timeline in which I still have my onion photo. Beautiful. Do y'all, uh... Anju? Miss Mannequin? Y'all, uh, how do you feel about onions? I got a real nice photo of an onion here. Let me, let me show you. Yeah, you like this onion photo? This onion photo can be yours for a mere hundred money. Oh, okay, fine. We'll just admire this onion photo together in our final hours while we wait for cafe. Although I suppose it is a photo of an onion that exists within her kitchen. 
so she's probably well familiar with that onion. So maybe she's nonplussed. Or, let's face it, she's probably uh, got uh, other things on her mind. But what if this photograph is the only evidence that that onion ever existed? Heck and gosh. Now we're getting deep. I can speed up time. Whoa. Okay, I think I'm gonna... Because I don't think... I don't think anything reloads if we accelerate time here. Inverted song, return the flow of time to normal. Yes! Let's hope this doesn't break stuff. All right, we're still here. Time ticks faster. We're doing all right. Once we get the mask, that's uh we can we can reset time, I think. I don't I'm not sure what the what the punishment is for letting the world uh collapse <laughs> for for letting the world end. Like, I'm sure it doesn't just delete your save file, but I wonder, when does the game resume? What is, what do you, how much, does it just take you to the latest, latest save? I, I just didn't know. I've never ended the world before. Okay, gotcha. Yeah, just reverts to the latest save, I guess. So we'll avoid that! <laughs> this is, uh, some, uh, some work that was done that I would like to be preserved. Can we look outside at all? Nope! Them's not real windows. These are not genuine copies of windows. These are pirated windows. Someone installed these with a fake CD key. Yeah, that's the thing is I haven't I haven't uh, seen the moon death cutscene yet, so I feel like I have to have to initiate that at least once. Whoa. What? Okay. <laughs> Places, please. I... I've met you before. What a familiar scent. Long, long ago. Yeah. We were still young. We made a promise, didn't we? The masks of the sun and the moon. We were to exchange them on the day of the Carnival of Time. Anju. I'm sorry, I was late. Welcome home. <laughs> They're lovers, but they look just like a mother and child. Let us exchange the promised masks. We have exchanged our oaths and have become a couple. You are our witnesses. Please accept this mask. You got the couple's mask. It's filled with their love. Please take refuge. We're fine here. We shall greet the morning together. The two gave you a happy mask. <laughs> this was added to your notebook. Let's take a look at said notebook here. 
Did we... Ooh! Mayor Dutour! We never, uh... I mean, he doesn't have... He doesn't have a mask for us, right? We also never did this thing. So, not exactly 100%. There's an NPC we still haven't met. But, that's fine. Interesting. Okay, that's fine. I think there's nothing to it but to reset time here. Because look at that! Every single one of the masks. Can I put this on? I can! Wonderful. Slightly creepy, but also wonderful. Okay, let's see. Let me make sure... <clears throat> Before I reset the time loop here, let me make sure... No, nothing else is required to get the uh, Fierce Deity Mask. Uh, here we go. I do have all 20 non-transformation masks. To get the Fierce Deity's Mask, Link must complete the trials inside the moon and give all 20 normal masks <clears throat> to the moon children. The last child wearing Majora's Mask will give Link this mask because he has no non-transformation masks left. Wear it to assume Fierce Deity, Link. But only in boss rooms. This transforms Link into an adult form armed with the powerful two-handed Fierce Deity Sword, which can deal multiple times the damage of the base Kokiri Sword and shoot beams! Let's see here. Okay, so let's let's be thorough. After Link has collected all of the other masks in the game, check, <laughs> wahoo, and arrives inside the moon. What does inside the moon mean? Just before the final boss battle, the area is empty except for a solitary tree. Uh... Challenge can be attempted without every mask, but Link is forced to stop and forfeit his reward once he runs out of masks to give the children. Okay, so I think... So is this... how do I get into... how do I get inside the moon? Is that, uh... Okay, gotcha. That's what I was thinking. Confront Skull Kid. Okay, but we have... We've got all the masks here, so let's do... A, uh... Let's do a sa uh, save and quit isn't entirely right. Let's reset the time loop. <clears throat> save and return to dawn of the first day. Oh, yeah. Wahoo here. All masks acquired. Heck, yeah. Loving that. <laughs> there's, <laughs> there's apparently an, an entire NPC we have we've never met. Which is peculiar, but that's fine. We're about to save. Oh yeah, that's right. I remember reading about that. We can take the couple's mask to the mayor. But first, and much more importantly, we can see how the uh, child over here responds <laughs> to the couple's mask. Did I lose my milk? I lost my milk! Aw, my mom and dad have that. Well, that's just cute. Uh, mayor's office opens at 10, yeah? Yep, 10 a.m. Alright, so let's see here. 
Um. What can we? Okay, what am I gonna? What I'm gonna do? What I'm gonna do? Oh, that's right. Yeah, I remember reading about uh, some NPC in the bathroom there that you can apparently give letters to, and I the the walkthrough was urging me to not give a letter. One of the crucial letters to them. Let's see. Time to do the fairy farm. You got a fairy in a bottle. Loving that. Just a little bit of taste of the Zora theme. Yet more fairy. <laughs> That's all you're allowed to hear. All right, and Una Mas. We got four fairies in our pocket. We can die so many times. It's exhilarating is what it is. <clears throat> Let's uh, put the couple's mask back on. And uh, sure, the hook shot, why not? All right. Uh, yes, the Song of Soaring. Let's get back to town! Where the stuff is! I like stuff! Do you like stuff? If you like stuff, let me know in the comments below! It's my understanding that, uh, stuff is cool! And if you're a, uh... If you're a They Might Be Giants fan... Stuff is also way! Still seven. Well, let's see here. Let's see just how much we can accelerate the passage of time. We're gonna make time go faster by doing stuff. That's a good doing stuff. And... Gam Gam is down here to tell us a story for old time's sake. To fast forward us to 10 a.m. The time-traveling grandmother. I would like to hear the carnival of time just once more. There we go. Are you awake? Regrettably. Alright, it's ten! I don't know if that actually did save any IRL time, but, uh... It was a lot more stimulating to look at, <clears throat> that's for sure. Hey, look at the pace on you. Proud of you, friend. Way to go. Let's see if we can get in there before 11. And we do! Hooray! Still made it in a 10. Loving that. Mr. Mayor, sir. Ah! 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 The couple's mask. What a nice reminder. So a young couple has been married in some timeline. I wonder, 
Did my wife flee? What? What did you just say? Yes, yes, everyone. We are all worried for our families. Why don't we end this meeting? But, Mr. Mayor, this will do. Whether you're stubborn and will stay and guard your family, or if you prefer to run far away and seek shelter, that is for people to decide on their own. Her. Her, her, her. Thank you for allowing me to put an end to all of that pointless bickering. Adults are all so stubborn. It's shameful. Here is a token of my gratitude. We got a piece of heart. Well, I may be an unreliable mayor, but at least my family can depend on me. I want to protect my wife. You saved the <laughs> You saved the mayor from a tedious meeting. That is worth a heart piece, I'll tell you that much. That, yeah, I've never sympathized more with <laughs> an N a Zelda NPC. That meeting, most assuredly, could have been an email. Thank you, Link, for saving me from that. Uh, let's see, is there... Okay, I'll tell you what we're gonna do then. Um... What else is the... Let's take a look at the notebook. Uh, let's see. Oh, it's a whole lot of... A whole lot of well done. Let's see here. Uh, I think the... The only thing... I haven't done his, uh... Frame perfect 10 second quest yet. And I think I'm okay with that. I think I've gotten as close as, like, 10 seconds and three hundredths. So, like, a frame off, I guess. Um, I think I did collect the the mailbox heart piece. Quite the tip. And then this is the strange toilet person, apparently. So, yeah, I'm pleased with that. So, what we're gonna do... Well, we're gonna do... Wait, are you... What are you, what are you lot... Captain Visson, the mayor's orders are absolute. So the gate guards are still standing by. Standing by? Cripes. Cripes on a cracker. The bad news is, we don't have a photograph of an onion anymore. That's a pity. But, it's fine. Um, what we're gonna do... We're gonna set time, uh, reset time. We're gonna save and quit here. Or not so. We're gonna reset the time loop. And we're gonna get a glimpse of the, uh... Dawn of the first day. We're gonna get a glimpse of the, uh... Of the end of the world cutscene. Why not? Just because it's, uh... It's cool. <laughs> I haven't seen it yet, but I'm, uh, I'm itching. And ostensibly, uh, when the world ends, we'll just get reset back to exactly this point where, uh, nothing will be lost. So I'm digging that. Yeah, this is fine. All right, let's, uh... Let's do a whole lot of uh, time reset, uh, time speedy uppies here. Night of the first day. Ahoy. Oh, the couple's mask uh, glows in the dark as well. That's uh. That's a, uh, plus two percent uh, romance bonus right there. It's a pity Link is single. No one to share his glow-in-the-dark romance with. Well, that was a weird sentence. That's what people come here for. The weird sentences that I 
wish I could take back, but can't. <laughs> when you got a vamp for four hours at a time, some weird stuff happens. Dawn of the final day. Twenty four hours remain. I especially wonder. I think, uh, mm. yeah, peekaboo. All right, let's make it night of the final day. I'll see if I can... Let's take a look through the telescope. Let's take some opportunity here to look through the telescope and see just what everything looks like when the, when the big bad moon is as close as possible. Night of the final day. Twelve hours. Whoa. I know it doesn't, but the uh, couple's mask, its little icon there in the top right, looks like it's smirking and winking at you. Not sure what to make of that. If you want to pass through here, that's right. Uh, 69, uh, 420, there we go. Job well done. There's a lot of cool stuff. Justice. Forever! Been a while. And any pots for me to be breaking? I guess I do have Deku Link on my hotbar. And that's gonna come in handy very shortly. Yep. Unless... We got some madge, and that's probably all we're gonna get, so it's fine. Let's, uh, let's destroy the frame rate. There we go. That's a good frame rate bomb right there. Hoosh! This chicken is still just hanging out in its eternal prison. Gotta feel a bit bad for it. Well, you're a child I've never seen in town before, new friend of the bombers. You can use this telescope. Sure. What does the telescope show us on this, the night of the final day? I can I can zoom in even. Okay, and you gotta zoom in on the nose. I see he's recently trimmed his nose hair. It's a good thing that he's groomed himself before his big his big show. Good job, sir. We got a moon tear. It didn't have to fall that far this time. No Nana or Boo Boo. Interesting. Just hung out and mocked. Did you discover anything interesting? Some might say. <clears throat> Best view is Romani Ranch on the uh, Romani Ranch. Uh, house roof. Gotcha. Oh, heck. I'll collect it then. I wasn't gonna. But then it made me step outside. Milk road. How do you make a road out of milk? Surely it'd have to be cheese road.
Uh, no. Not the right way. There we go. I found the cheese road. Gotta do this for uh, old time's sake, for sure. There we go. Help myself to some, uh, some vegan muns here. Nothing but the most plant-based money. Thanks for your hard work, Mr. Man. Greatly appreciated. And... <clears throat> we can't have a Majora's Mask finale without a little bit of Epona action, I don't think. Come here, my horsey friend. Who's a good horse? Yeah, you're a good horse. Rotate your horse. It's good. Can I get on the roof? I mean, I guess I can try to hookshot. Thank you, Epona. Opens at 6 a.m. Gotta tell you, probably not gonna happen. It's locked. Alright, oh. Yep, creepy for sure. Can I That ain't ha that ain't how you do it. Also not how you do it. How about Um Tree Always with the trees. Is this a thing? Can I get on here? How about... Oh, how do I... Are there boxes that can be climbed? Or... Oh, found that statue. Ooh, it's rumbling. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Simply a ladder. We found the ladder of time. We beat the ladder boss. Go us. Can I just... This looks... Uh, eminently jumpable. Uh, no, I guess not. It'd be nice to sort of crash the party, but I don't think that's the thing. <laughs> There's no ladder on this side. Ooh. All right. Yeah, no, can't jump. All right. Oh, that's some big creepy stuff. Can I... What can I do here? Um... No, it's fine. Yeah, that makes it go quiet, too. Let's, uh... Tell you what we're gonna do. Now that we know how to get back up on top of there, uh, quickly. There we go. I'm gonna take a look at the sign and then stop time real quick because it's time for uh, the second break of today's stream. I'm gonna once again stand up, do some stretches, get some water. If you're able to do those things, I recommend that you do, as your body loves them all really very much. When we come back, we're gonna end the world! <laughs> and then we're gonna reset. And then we're gonna end the game the proper way. Oh boy. Oh boy. I can hardly wait. Um, gosh. Although there is also that... Uh... It's fine. It's fine. Um, yeah, if this is your first time here, this is very much what we do. We play beloved old games for the first time and we enjoy the heck out of them. If that sounds like your bag, I recommend a like, a follow, subscribe, etc. It's fast and free, and it'll keep you connected for our future retro gaming shenanigans. If you're already a fan, something you can do to help grow the channel is uh, you can make uh, some clips on Twitch or on YouTube. You can uh, leave a comment with a timestamp to some of your favorite moments. I can turn that timestamp into clips and put them all over the internet and get a lot of good attention that way. Uh, when we come back, the world's gonna end, 
and it'll be fine. Because that's how this game works. <laughs> be back in just a little bit. Hang tight.
Hello everybody, I hope you are having a comfy, a cozy, and an orange Tuesday afternoon. We're back with Majora's Mask and it's the end of the world as we know it. But I feel fine, because this is a... Uh, this is a, just a cutscene that we haven't seen yet, and I thought, heck, let's, uh, let's take a look at it. We've made so much progress, we're almost here at the end of the game, or certainly at the end of the world. We've gotten all of the masks! Exciting and thrilling. We've gotten four bottles anyway, that'll do. That'll do nicely, that's for sure. Let's take a look at our uh, notebook real quick. What's our what's our playthrough looked like so far? Many uh, many gratitude patches or whatever they're called. <laughs> the uh, the postman is still not fully gracious, unfortunately. And there's a uh, mysterious toilet NPC that we never got around to meeting. But outside of that, looking pretty good. I'm satisfied with how thoroughly we've uh, played this game. For sure. Incredibly fun, of course. This, uh, this entire time loop is dedicated to, uh, nothing but watching the world end here, so when this happens we shouldn't lose any progress or anything. We'll just simply be reset to the beginning of a time loop in which we did nothing. <laughs> so, that's, uh, that's some creepy stuff. But yeah, this has been a wonderful, fun time with Majora's Mask. What a wonderful game. Never played it before, and here we are nearing the end of it. Not quite... There, there's one more thing that I want to do before we... Okay, so the, a, a checklist for this, the final Majora's Mask stream. Um, I want to watch this cutscene, Where the World Ends. Just because I haven't seen it before, and I hear it's cool, eh? So let's see the cool thing. Um, and then I found... Earlier today I found some sort of side quest trial dungeon kind of thing. In, near, uh, near the canyon. That looks interesting. Let's go check that out. Why not? Um... I doubt it's going to take an entire three-day cycle to complete. Famous last words, but we'll find out. Um, and then after we do that, let's do it. Let's beat the game. Mm. So exciting. So exciting. This is... It's been... Far too long since I... I I've taken much too long to get around to playing this game, I should say. I, I rem remember being a wee youth and renting it back in the day. I remember playing, you know, Ocarina when that came out. Be that was like my first like real like video game experience, Ocarina, right? <laughs> um, and loved that game to bits and still do. Um, and I remember walking into my local rental place one day and seeing what? Another Zelda game on the N64? Ocarina 2? Um, creepy boogaloo? Uh, did you, uh, wow, put me down for that. I rented that, and... Well, back in the day anyway, my tiny little child brain couldn't wrap my mind around the time loop thing. <laughs> it just confused me a little bit. Um, so I couldn't really grok it back then, but clearly it's been grokked this time around. More than, uh... <laughs> I've, I've, I've matured just a little bit, I think, uh... I've matured exactly the right amount required to uh, <laughs> to be able to complete and enjoy this game. Oh boy, this is tense. This is. I feel fine. Honestly, it's great. It's fine. Nothing bad's gonna happen. Six o'clock TV hour. Don't get caught in foreign towers. Slash and burn. Rechurn listen to yourself turn I think oh I forget I know most of the lyrics to that song anyway it's time
So that's how it feels to chew five gum. <laughs> You've met with a terrible fate, haven't you? How did you do? You'll be fine. Surely you should be able to recover Majora's Mask. I believe in you. Ah, but time passes even as we speak. There are only 72 hours left. Ho ho ho. Oh. Oh. Yep, indeed. We still have all of the good stuff. Glad. Dang. That's some dramatic stuff for sure. Um... Yes. <laughs> Played this entire game, Near As Makes No Difference, and I still forget <laughs> which which song of time is forward and backwards. Oh. And apparently I've still never gotten the hang of what is indoors and what is outdoors. None of the first day. Let's hold down the ocarina button, so on the first frame possible. Nope. <laughs> Darn, I tried to buffer my inputs and everything. No such luck, however. Alright. Slowing down the time. Slow that flow. And I want to take a look at this uh, little side dungeon here that we discovered while we were completing the, uh, the saddest quest of all time. Um, Ikana Canyon. There it is. Soar, my boy! It just sounds fun, is all. We've, uh, we've got everything. Uh, so surely we're able to do the thing. Whoosh! And splash. Remember! You don't take fall damage in water. In real life as well. That's that's so not true. <laughs> that's that's a bad wisdom right there. But uh, is there anything interesting down here? The weird thing about falling in water is arguably you take more fall damage in real life if you land in water than on solid land. <laughs> Most solid land will have a little bit of give to it. Water, uh, not so much. Secret shrine. Do I need bugs? I think I need bugs here. Let's, uh, let me read that sign again before I... Let's get... Oh. <laughs> let's get primed with knowledge here. Secret shrine behind waterfall. Now awaiting the challenges of bold visitors, sure of their might. He, he, he. Interesting. I wonder who... I wonder who. Okay, anyway. Um, got some arrows. Got some madge. Oop, see a bug. That might be required. We have... Collected a bug in a bottle. What else can you, uh... Can you bestow upon me here? Just some muns is what I'm seeing. Okay. No fish present. Okay. What am I... What am I looking at there? Lens of truth time! That's certainly... unique. Alright. I guess I'll figure that out. Um... Let's deposit some bugs. Oh, probably if I plant a seed here, um, it'll grow a, a hover plant that'll take me around the room and 
give me all those rupees. That's fine. <clears throat> I don't want a, uh, I don't want a magic, or a, I don't want, what was a 30 rupees that badly. Wrong arrow. I've played this game before, I swear. Right between the eyes. Yeah, <laughs> it seems somehow you have managed to send the Ikana's wandering spirits into peace. But outside of Ikana, there are still swarms of wandering spirits with lingering regrets. The ones in this room want to meet you again, and have been waiting here for quite a while. Go see them if you feel like it. I'm sure they'll welcome you. <laughs> Bye. The ones in this room, eh? Alright, so we got four things we can do here, I think. Let's pop on the ghost hunting mask. Ooh, there's some... There's some stuff on the floors. Okay. We live here now. Oh. Sound like my cat. Uh... Okay. Loving the one-shot blade. <laughs> that's, that's that's real nice. <laughs> that's a good uh that's a good one-shot blade. Digging that. Hey, we got some muns. Digging the muns. Can't be sad about that. I mean, you can, but You know, having I will, I will accept that having too much money can have its own stresses, but uh, having too little money is uh, is worse. So <laughs> I'm uh, I'm fine with having too much. Are there any secrets around here? I don't think there are. Doesn't hurt to check though. It's all good. And... Let's see here. There are two paths we can go by. Oop. We'll go by this one. Another whiz robe. <laughs> Just what the doctor ordered. I was looking forward to not having to play, uh, fight any of these again, but, uh... So it goes. Not my favorite enemy. Fool! Where, uh... Where are you? There you are. You've been fooled again. Oh, so close. And yet. Whoa, camera. I I lost him. There we go. Okay. Now let's get real here. He's committed. We got him, at least. He could be anywhere, except here. There we go. Loving it. Everyone loves the whiz robes.
Yet more Mons. That seems to be... I suppose this late in the game, there really can't be a lot of meaningful rewards outside of just like, you know, heart pieces, <laughs> I think, <laughs> at this point. It's not like there's a mask at the end of this or anything, because we, uh, we done got all those. Yeah, I was hoping for some more sort of, uh, yeah, if you want to meet the ones in this room, then extend your life energy more. Oh, that's interesting. Your life energy. Does that mean I need a bigger health bar before I can go in there? Or does that mean I'm low on magic? Or does that mean I haven't doubled my magic bar? Extend your life energy more. Okay. Interesting. I wonder what that means. Let's, uh... Let's hop down here. Do the big Zora. Do the big sink. Get sunk. Way to sink. Oh, I was hoping for some magic. There we go. It talks about life, but it also talks about energy. You say energy, that makes me think stamina. And stamina is referred to as... When stamina is referred to, it's usually done in the context of stamina is magic. So let's see if it's just my magic meter was too low. No? Okay. I don't have enough hearts, I guess. All right. Pity. Um, it might be... Maybe this corresponds to the fairies, the great fairies we've only ever received two of the four blessings. Maybe, uh... Maybe more blessings are required here. Hard to know. Uh, or simply, we are being gatekept because our health, uh, we have too few hearts. Which is also fine. Pity, but also, like I said earlier, the reward for it can't be too valuable. We've already got all the masks. And we have all of the items, and we have all of the songs, and we've got we've got all of everything, so... Really, there's just not a lot we can... ...receive from such side quests. We found, uh, we found Sakone. Interesting. No, stop that, please. <laughs> hey, that's a nice sword you have. <laughs> you know, lately, uh, frightening ghosts have been appearing in swarms in Akana village across the river. It seems they're the ghosts of Akana's royal family or something. There's no one living there anymore, so I uh, moved nearby. Now nah, there's only a curious parent and child living there while they research the ghosts. Did I mention that's one nice sword? Can <laughs> I see it for a second? Yeah, sure. Oh, fine. I do have to wonder. <laughs> okay, if I had to guess, if you give him your sword, he just Fs off, and then you have to buy it from the curiosity shop. That's my guess. <laughs> but, I don't know, maybe something interesting would happen if I were to, were to do such a thing. But, I'm not gonna. What I am gonna do, though. Uh, no, no, no. I'm gonna return the flow of time to normal. Is that how we do that? Yes, it is. Okay, great. <laughs> and now we're gonna stock up on some fairies. Uh, and to that end, there we go. Here's our, our fairy our fairy farm. Whoosh! And we blink out of existence. Uh, 
All right. Let's uh let's throw some bottles on our hot bar, shall we? <laughs> what? Did he did he jinx my sword here? There we go. I didn't know you could smack the pots with your super ultra mega sword and not break them. That was that was an unusual thing that happened right there. Okay. Yet another fairy in a bottle. Can we go for the hat trick? That was nice and precise. We broke only the one bottle we needed to. Or one pot, rather. And let's get one more fairy for our troubles. And then it's uh, end of the game time, I think. This is, this is it. This is all we got left to do here. <laughs> all we got left is just beating the game. Heck, there we go. Four fairies. We need that on our hot bar. Um, I don't really know what else we need. Guessing some light arrows, why not? And why not a, a really big sword? The heckin' big blade. That's what it's called. There, we've turned. We've made time flow as normal. So let's go to Clock Town. Whoosh! Blink out of existence yet again. The music's so happy, though. Nothing bad could happen to this town. Heck, in fact, I'll make sure of it that nothing bad happens to this town. This time, for sure. Uh, zoom in on the dog's butt. That's uh, some good camera work right there. Way to go, N64. <laughs> Night of the first day. Heck, sure. How about a little bit of Dawn of the Second Day action? That sounds right up my alley. I could run off to, uh, Grandma Storytime to, uh, jump forward 24 hours at a time. But it's fine. Night of the second day. We also learned that Granny is not present at all on the third day, so... When she would be most useful, arguably, she is not there, unfortunately. It's fine, though. She's just off saving her own life. Which is... Admirable. Dawn of the final day, 24 hours remain. And we're just gonna evaporate 12 of them. Heck, why not? Night of the final day? Yeah. So when do I play the uh, Oath to Order? Do I play that at the top of the tower? during the, uh, the boss fight? Or should I be playing that at a different time? It's the final night. I don't think this is opened yet. There we go. Thanks for the heart. I guess we just hang out and wait. Fortunately, 
Mr. Moon Man had the good graces to uh, trim his nose hair before his appearance. It's uh, important to groom yourself before special occasions, and I'm glad to see Mr. Moon Man agrees. Uh, let's see, I'm gonna look this up real quick. When is the best, when is the, when is the intended time to play Oath to Order? Um... Once all four giants have been freed from their seal, they will come and prevent the evil menace from destroying Termino, while Link and Tattle enter the moon to defeat... In the case that not all giants have been saved, not be able to stop the moon. So do I use...? Let's see here. While we await the doom... Usage. On the final day, Link must go up the clock tower at midnight and call the four giants in order to stop the moon. The giants hold the moon in place just long enough for Link to defeat Majora's Mask and save the day. If Link plays the song atop the clock tower prior to rescuing the fourth giant, etc. Okay, they won't be strong enough. Alright, great! So yeah, we'll uh, wait till midnight. We'll wait the three additional hours until midnight. And we'll beat the game! Heck and gosh, how exciting. If this is your uh, first time here, when we finish up with the Majora's Mask, on Thursday, when we stream again, we're going to start our first playthrough of Earthbound! I've never played that either! What's the matter with me? I suppose, like like most fans of Earthbound, I have never played it. <laughs> so I'm looking forward to to uh, ending my uh, my no Earthbound streak and actually playing the thing. There's, I, I've 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 watched countless speedruns of Earthbound um, and made many friends in the Earthbound community over the years, but never actually played it myself. So, you know, the uh, <clears throat> the story beats of Earthbound, anyway, I sort of have a vague grasp on. But in terms of, like, actually playing the thing, I don't have a lot of... <laughs> I don't have a lot of knowledge. I think uh, <clears throat> prior experience with that game, I got as far as uh, Tucson. I left Onet in my prior experiences with that game, but uh, that's about as far as I ever got. <laughs> I look forward to uh, experiencing the game in its entirety on my own, for real. So yeah, that's what we're uh, that's what we're doing after we finish Majora here. Some Earthbound first time shenanigans. That sounds fun, doesn't it? If that does sound fun, a like, follow, subscribe, etc. is recommended. It's fast and free, and it'll keep you connected. Can't wait for that. Also, we're at 99 followers on Twitch. 99! We're one away from triple digits! Who wants to be lucky number follower... or lucky number... <laughs> lucky follower number 100? The words are there. Put them in any order you like. Until they... they mean something to you. <laughs> oh boy. Here we go. Uh, midnight! It's time. I've been waiting for this, no doubt. And what we're gonna do... Uh... Yes. Now we're gonna slow time, just in case that matters. I don't think it does. But just in case, for the, for the final time, we're going to slow that flow. Oh yeah. All right. 
Anything else? I think that's it. I think we're ready to do the thing. We got all the masks. We got all the masks. We got all the remains. Sis! Tail! Swamp, mountain, ocean, canyon. Hurry! The four who are there. Bring them here. Don't speak out of line, stupid fairy. Exclamation point, exclamation point, exclamation point. That's it. I won't let things uh, go the way you expect them to. Well, whatever. Even if they were to come now, they wouldn't be able to handle me. <laughs> just look above you. If it's something that can be stopped, then just try to stop it. Challenge accepted. Uh, how does the song go? <laughs> I've never... Uh, let's see. Uh, right down, A down, right up. Where are my friends? The big friends. Sure could use their assistance right now. Oh? The N64 can hardly contain all of the awesomeness. If it's something that can be stopped, just try and stop it. Challenge accepted. Put your hands in the air. Hold up a giant doomsday moon like you just don't care. It... It stopped. We, we did it! It stopped! Sis! Tail! Good. We made it in time. The giant's call worked on the Skull Kid. Hey. You realize what you've been doing to everyone? Wait, Sis. Don't... Don't be so hard on the Skull Kid. Tail, why are you protecting him? Aren't you mad at him for hitting you so much? He was lonely, the Skull Kid. He was trying to destroy everything around him. <laughs> that's, that's the wrong tone. <laughs> Mulligan, he was trying to destroy everything around him. That is not the same as a lonely child. We can't... we can't allow that. 
The power of the mask made him do it. It was too much for the Skull Kid to handle. It's because he doesn't know his place. On top of having a weak will, he has no strength of heart. He's a fool. Certainly, he had far too many weaknesses to use my power. Yeah, that's right. Admit you're stupid. Huh? A puppet that can no longer be used as mere garbage. This puppet's role has just ended. It can't be! And that moon! Slurp! Oh dang. I shall consume, consume everything. Ooh, wow, this isn't good. Let's go back, let's go back, hurry. The Song of Time, the Song of Time. Oh, no, you've got to be kidding. Don't tell me you're going up there. I won't do it. You go by yourself. I'm staying here with Tail. I'll go. What? What are you saying, Tail? Is something wrong with you? I don't always want to be running away. If only I had been stronger, the Skull Kid wouldn't have... <sighs> I understand. I'll go. After all this time, Tail, you've gotten really stubborn. Just like someone else I know. You know, you guys are really stupid. <laughs> In we get. Get slurped. There it is. I'm gonna say. Surely I have some uh, camera control at a time like this. And indeed we do. What a view. What's, uh, what's over here? <laughs> Nothing. Okay. I mean, I gotta... What happens if I... How far do I have to... Am I just gonna hit, like, a Truman Show? Uh... <laughs> just, just wall. Solid wall here at the end. <laughs> okay. It's an invis wall. And it's not even a bombable invis wall. Whoop. That's right. The, uh, the world is uh, casually reminding me that it's coming to an end, and I still have to do things. So, okay. We'll go do some things. The reluctant hero. Will save the world, I guess. Butterfly. Everything's getting dreamlike. Will you play with me? You have only weak masks, so you'll play? Well, shall we go? Oh, I think I did the wrong thing. I think I meant to get the Fierce Deity Mask, and I just, uh, opted myself out of it there. Or not? Hard to say. No, yeah, I think I did. Ugh. Hang on, we can't, uh... We did all this work to get Fierce Deity's Mask. We gotta get the Fierce Deity Mask. Can I, uh...
played the song of time. Yep, we can still do the thing. Okay. This is no time to be... <laughs> <laughs> Slightly anticlimactic. I can apologize for that. Um, all right, we're gonna do another fairy farm, and then we're gonna do the thing, and it's gonna be great. Dawn of the first day. Gonna grab some fairies. <laughs> then we're gonna do it for real this time. Uh, first things first. Um, let's talk to uh, the time-traveling granny over yonder so that we can accelerate time one day at a time for a little bit of faster happening here and pop okay I just happened to talk to the wrong Skull Kid at the wrong time. It's a pity. But fortunately, it is a pity that can be undone. And we're gonna undo it. Tortoise. Which story? Now, I know I'm a fan of the Carnival of Time story, but... I think I'm in the mood for a Four Giants story this time. Give me that gusto. Oh, are you awake? I am. Oops. Let me read you a story. Four giants, Shar. Vroom. And just like that, dawn of the final day. And now... Uh, hang on. Come on. There it is. Let's make it night of the final day. <laughs> Always. I gotta get out of my own way here. We got a world to save. Okay. Night of the final day, don't mind if I do! Okay. And now... <laughs> there it is. It likes, uh, it likes ignoring my first input because I just play the song so quickly. Zora Cape for a quick little bit of fairy farming. Who needs a big health bar when you can just quadruple the size of it by the use of some clever fairy action here? All right, in we get. Out we get. Wahoo. Six in-game hours to go. I can actually use some arrows, so I'm going to collect those as well. <laughs> Wahoo! One more bottle. Or one more fairy. Oh yeah! Alright, now. Uh, sure. And... Sure. Take me back to Clock Town. 
It's a, it's kind of an important place to be right now. Whoa, and splash. It's a good thing we fell in the water. We can't be, uh, beating the game in dry clothes now. All right. There we go. And now we wait. It's. It has to be said that it is very incredible how much game they made in how little time <laughs> they gave. They. I say they gave themselves. They were given. 18 months, basically, to to make another Zelda game after Ocarina. Um, and there's, there's definitely a lot of ways in which I think this game would have benefited from having, you know, more time in the oven. <laughs> right? There are some... There, there are some ways in which it's it, 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 just not as refined or polished mechanically as as other games as ocarina for instance um but you know they clearly did the best they could with the time they had and it's uh certainly uh this moon this horrifying end of the world moon is certainly a uh a compelling uh metaphor for uh, impending deadlines <laughs> and, and uh, treating your employees inhumanely. So, yeah, you know, if you're ever going to be in charge of anybody, any actual real human beings, it's good to uh, remember that they are, in fact, human beings. I think um, the people that were working on this game, for those 18 months the game was in development, just 12-hour shifts seven days a week for 18 months of their lives just to get this game out on time. That's, uh... That's some pretty rough stuff. So, suffice it to say, uh... Be, be kind to, uh... Be, be kind to, you know, uh, people that you may or may not be in charge of in your life. Heck, when in doubt, just be kind to everybody. Except for, uh, except for this giant moon man here. Don't, you don't have to be kind to him. You can go ahead and, uh, we can go ahead and, and dissolve this fellow. That's, I'm alright with that. There we go. And in fact, we will dissolve him in... Just a couple minutes. Heck and gosh. So I think I was reading that we have to interact with the... <laughs> so there, there are five Skull Kids there, and we just happened to interact with the, <laughs> the wrong one at the wrong time. The first opportunity we got. But there are others. And I think I was reading that if we interact with them in the correct order... Um, which is to say the order we did the dungeons. Um, then we'll be given the Fierce Deity Mask. Something like that. Which we've come this far. We gotta do it. It's gotta be done. How can we not? And in fact, any second now. Boom! Okay, I was gonna <laughs> I was gonna skip this cutscene if possible because we just watched this mere minutes ago, but this is fine too. It's a pretty one. I'll let it slide. The tower is converted. And just for the sake of it.
Still unsure, is that the right one? <laughs> is that what I meant to play? Inverted song. Slow that flow. There we go. For real this time. The final slowing of the flow. All right. Let's get up there. As a matter of fact, let me go ahead and I'm going to run some real quick ads here to make sure that nothing of importance is uh, interrupted on Twitch. All right. Sis. Tail. Swamp, mountain, etc. Don't speak out of line. That's it. I won't let things go the way you expected them to. Well, whatever. Even if they were to come now, they wouldn't be able to handle me. Just look above you. If it's something that can be stopped, then just try to stop it. Once again, challenge accepted. Ah, Karina. If I can rem remember the... There it is. Okay. <laughs> the uh, the electric meatball inside my skull has uh, proved to have some value again. Good old trusty electric meatball. Doing the brain's work. Well, heck, we get to watch the awesome cutscene again. That's never a bad thing. I would say that the giants look a bit like they've been uh, skipping leg day, but clearly not a <laughs> clearly not to a problematic extent. They have been they have been uh, attending the exact right amount of leg days, clearly. So good on them. Put your hands in the air and catch the giant doomsday rock like you just don't care. Well done! Raise the roof! That is one raised roof, all right. It stopped. Sis, tail. Well, now you should be awake. Stand up. Wait, sis. Skull Kid. Don't blame him. Yeah, yeah, I know. The Skull Kid was lonely because nobody would be his friend, blah, blah, blah. This is... <laughs> <isn't it? laughs> So they, <laughs> they, I didn't think, I wasn't expecting that. We got, this is our second time watching this cutscene, so the text has been changed slightly. That's incredible. <laughs> the power of the mask made him do it, because it was too much for him to handle. How, how did you know that, sis? That's incredible. <laughs> Certainly he had far too many weaknesses to use my power. 
A puppet that can no longer be used is mere garbage. This puppet's role has just ended. It can't be. Then that moon... Get swallowed. I shall consume... Consume... Everything. See what I was saying about leg day? Don't worry, just leave it to your sister. Well, you're going in, aren't you? That's incredible. I didn't expect the uh, the dialogue to actually change. We can't do anything down here. Let's go! Been thinking this ever since I joined you. You never want to give up. You always want to try. I admire you. Dang! Cool! <laughs> All right, and we already know there's an invis wall over there. Let's head this way. And let's talk to the right skull kid this time. Butterfly. All right, so let's see which uh, big butterfly in the way of the camera. So conceivably, not that one, but... Which one are... Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Alright, is there... How do I d identify you? That's, uh, that's the George fish, I think. Um... That... That's, um... Uldorwa, that's it. I was gonna say Ungaga, but that's a dark cloud thing. Ah, nice weather, isn't it? Masks. You have a lot. You too. Will you be a mask salesman? Then I'll play with you. So, the masks. Give me some. Hmm. Can I give you... Nope. Give you some, okay. Thanks. You... You're a nice person, aren't you? Hide and seek. Let's play. Alright. I'll hide. Yeah, he took the mask, alright. Alright, time for a bit of a... Whoa, we're not gonna make it! Let's try this one over here. We're also not gonna make this one. Yeah. And pop. Should be fine. Alright. Oof, okay. A little tricky. Dive! Ugh. <laughs> Heck. Ooh, a heart piece. Come out of a do. I'll take that. Right? I'll take it. There we go. <laughs> Whoa! I'll take that, sure. Hopefully that wasn't a fool's MacGuffin. Ooh, big height, big height. Loving that. It's enough height, right? It oh no. That's fine. The heart piece was worth. Up we get. And... Pop, pop. Dive! Whoa. Oh boy. 
and wait for that. There we go. Oh, it's close. Oh, heck. Is that not how do? Whoops. Okay, stay in there. I could have sworn that was how do, but turned out to not be how do. Go! Okay. Do these tell me anything interesting? Only got one opportunity to, uh, Read their input. Or I, I guess, strictly speaking, output. Mystical stone, etc. These words are heard in secret. Seems the leader of the Gorman troop had the circus leader's mask. I know. <laughs> Alright, let's see here. Ah, so close. And yet. Let's get me in there. Alright, made that happen. Do I... Do I use this one? I mean, maybe that's what the heart piece was there to signify. There we go. I was going to say. We were facing the wrong direction at the start. The first time we used that, so let's use the right... Let's face the right direction this time. Dang, man. All right. Surprisingly tight in all directions. There we go. That was a nice dive. So let's wait until this one goes overhead and there. That's I feel like that's as close as we can get. Ah, oh, I really don't know <laughs> if that's not it. Let's keep on keeping on. Yeah, I really feel like that's... Once it... Once this one goes overhead again, that's as close as it gets. As, as this platform gets to that one. Oh, maybe... Gosh, okay. I'm gonna try a little earlier then, I guess. It's a good thing time has stopped while we're in here. The uh, the leg day giants outside are uh, having a time of it, that's for sure. But they're coping. All right, let's see here. If I do it just a little bit early.
boy. Am I missing something? <laughs> like, why is why is am I, why am I having difficulty with this? What's the what's the right way to do it? Whoa, get in your hole. Ah. No hole for us. I mean, surely this doesn't... Surely that just takes us back outside. And we want to be going this way, right? I did that. Poorly. Well, heck. Let's see what this fella says. Kremia had Romani's mask, yeah. Okay. I wonder if I... I hope it's not I should be paying attention to these so that I know... which masks this particular kid is looking for. Poorly timed again. Alright. <laughs> Alright, good dive. Yeah, there's a, there's a, there's a thing over there. There's a door. Why'd that happen? <laughs> I was, I was clearly holding A. Alright, I have a good feeling about this one. Let's make the special thing happen. I like special things. Special things are pretty special. Push. Let's try. Oh, heck! What am I missing? Okay. Well, I can just hang out here without any punishment. Okay, so I don't... I don't get high enough to get on top of those branches. I can see... Uh... Okay, is it... <clears throat> Alright, well. Let's, uh... Let's do another experiment here. Oosh. Okay. So, I might be able to land on top of these branches. Uh, apparently not. <laughs> I was going to say we could land on those branches and climb our way. Feeling less confident about that plan now. Oh, heck. Hey now, there we go. We learned how to dive. Uh, 
I, hmm. Okay, that feels like the closest we can get. And I feel like we're still so far away. That just... That really strikes me as not the way to do it, but that also strikes me as the only way to do it. <laughs> Don't get high enough. Oh, I'm seeing finally. The okay. This one's orange. This one's a super put yourself up in the air thing. Gotcha. Uh, let's go over... Ooh, oh. That was close. <laughs> now I understand. There it is. I just happened to land on the not right one every single time. There we go. Well, now I know. What's up with you? A mask. Take it off. You found me. Hey, I want more masks. Uh. Well, you can have. You can probably have this one now. Not that. Hurry, put it away. I don't want to give that one away yet. The mask of truth. <laughs> Thanks. You're nice. Uh, can I ask a question? Your friends, what kind of people are they? I wonder, do those people think of you as a friend? Okay, let's see, where is, uh, goat? Where is the goat remain masked one? Your twin mold. Are you, are you goat? Yes. Nice weather, isn't it? You have a lot. Give me some. Oh, not the blast mask. I love the blast mask. More. Uh, sure, you can take the Keaton mask. Thanks. You're... You're a nice person, aren't you? Hide and seek. Let's play. All right, it's Goron time. This can uh, only go well. <laughs> yep, just as well as expected. Oh, good. This is the hard one. Lovely. All right, let's see here. Um, okay. Fortunately, I, I was wondering if the wall behind me was bombable, but I can tell because the camera is clipping through it. No. Uh, hang on, let me do better. Okay. Okay, so you want me to... Okay. Alright. This is what we're looking at here. A day at the races. Le 
left. Oh, actually, you know what? Maybe I don't even need to steer. Maybe the chests are arranged such that I don't even need to perform any input. Yeah, it's hopeful thinking for sure. Wishful thinking, but let's start from there. Okay. That is mostly the case, but also there is some more <laughs> some more uh, finesse required on my part to make something special happen here. Me and finesse, we got this thing going on. Woo! Okay. I think... So long as I hit that seam in between chests. Ooh! Oh. Okay. <laughs> Good news! I eventually found my way out of the, uh, the Deku Moon dungeon. <laughs> Whoa! That's a good start. Alright, let's try this again. Hmm. What's this? What is this? Okay. If I don't steer... Oh! Okay, we're out of magic. But that's fine. I think. Okay, yeah. Alright, let's collect some magic. I wasn't sure. I don't remember how many we had at the first at our... at the start of it. But yeah, here we go. And then if I just let the thing reset me, I'm pointing in the perfect direction, and off we trot. Okay, hold A, no more steering. This should just work. Still good on magic. More magic! Oh, and then, okay. <laughs> and then I do some stuff. Gotcha. Uh, this should be fine. Okay. Joystick at neutral. Boing. And boing. All right. What's, uh... Okay, just a time stone over yonder. Oh, boy. No, hang on. I think this might be... Oh, okay. Plenty of run-up space, though. Right? Yes, okay. <laughs> we need a few. <laughs> Alright. Oops, wrong mask. Hey, it's a good Dave stream. We hit the wrong button. Go us. Let me uh, run some ads here. To appease Papa Bezos. All right. Speak. You found me. Hey. 
I want more masks. You can also have the Bremen mask. I'm not too attached to this one. More. And the Harrow mask, why not? Thanks. You're nice. Can I ask a question? You. What makes you happy? I wonder. What makes you happy? Does it make others happy, too? I gotta tell you, me, I'm partial to grilled cheese sandwiches. Those, uh, those make me real happy. Without fail. Every time. And it's my understanding that, yeah, a whole lot of people feel the same <laughs> about, about grilled cheese sandwiches, so... I'm feeling pretty good about my choice. Which one are you? The next one I should be looking for is... Um... Well, you're a twin mold. So, you're not the right one. That's right, George Fish. We're looking for George Fish. Ah, nice weather, isn't it? Masks. You have a lot. Give me some. Um, I'm not a pi uh, I'm not attached to the Pigma Dengar mask, so you can have this one. More. Uh, similarly, Romani's mask creeps me out a little bit. More. Yeah, okay. You can have the, uh, you can have the crying man mask. Thanks. You're, you're a nice person, aren't you? Hide and seek. Let's play. All right, I'll hide. Okay, time for... Oh, okay. I thought... I thought the music was the sound of my footsteps here. But nope, it is the sound of music. Time to become as fish. Let's have a good swims. Okay, we're just going this way, I guess. I'm just gonna let it do what it do here. All right, we found a found a stone. That's for sure. Okay. Ooh, uh, this is gonna take some. This is gonna take some figuring, isn't it? Yep. Yeah, okay. Well, it's just a maze. Any guess left? Um. Boy, there's so many branching paths here. Are there actually? Maybe not. Dive. Eight. Okay, so there's two and then four. And then, okay, yeah, eight makes sense. Okay, so we've we've explored two of them. Can I uh, can I dive and explore this slowly? I'm gonna, uh, okay, I was gonna say I was gonna go right. Let's just go. Okay. Oh, actually, these are connected. There aren't that many. I think this is the one we just did. That's also fine. There are not that many... There aren't actually that many options. If I look at it strictly in terms of, like, left or right, making that choice, it looks as though there's eight options, but they're conjoined. Multiple paths take you to the same exit. So, let's do... Let's just, let's just do a series of lefts. Let's start there.
Okay. We've arrived at the here. Okay, let's try... Let's try the alright path. The alright path. The path wherein we take all rights. Got to the end of this one. And it's a stoon. Okay. So let's do the left. Let's do left. Let's do left, left, right. Uh, actually, that might have been the right way to go there. Okay, so yeah, alright. We're learning, we're getting the lay of the land here. Getting the lay of the pond here. Let's try left. I'm, I'm, I'm not convinced that we... That we didn't left properly here. And then I think... Not that one, but the next one. Yeah, this one. Oop, it was... Wait, okay, this is... Hey, did we do it? is looking different, that's for sure. I mean, it's it's looking different. Let's make sure I'm not... Hey, heart piece! Sneaky little heart piece. My maximum life has been increased. Wonderful. Okay. I don't know if that bodes well or poorly. Nope, we're back at the start. Okay. <laughs> yep. And let's do right. Uh, right, left. This time. That seems to be where the special rooms are. Or not. Or, yeah, no, not. No special room there. Let's try left, right, right. I don't think we've done that yet. Oh, nope. I think we've done left, right, left. Okay, no, we've been here a number of times now. I also have not looked up yet. Can I climb? I can. Just make sure... Okay. The roof is, aside from being tiled, also featureless. Let's try right, left, left. I think this is going to take us to... Yeah, we're in this room again. This is where the heart piece was. <laughs> ok. 
Okay. Push. All right, let's see. I'm gonna try left here. Try left, followed by an immediate right. Followed by a left. And a right. Is this gonna be the, the same room? The heart piece room? No, in fact, all right, we got there. You found me. Hey, I want more, uh, more masks. Um, giant's mask, I, uh, I'll tell you what. Uh, ooh, yeah, the Camaro mask, sorry, the El Camino mask. You can get the El Camino mask out of my inventory. That thing's creeping me out. More. Gibdo as well, why not? More. Insatiable little imp. Sure, Garo's mask. <laughs> Thanks. You're, uh, nice. Can I ask you a question? The right thing. What is it? I wonder, if you do the right thing, does it really make everybody happy? Only one more friend. Where, oh, where? Is there we are. We found, uh, we found the twin mold friend. Nice weather we're having. Take the captain's hat, sure. More. More. Um, I'm pretty fond of all of these, but I guess the blast mask will have to go. More. All right. Fairy mask, you're up. Thanks. You're a nice person, aren't you? Let's play hide and seek. I'll hide. All right. Plenty of magic. I wonder... I already gave away the giant's mask, so hopefully that's not required. <laughs> I'm sure they wouldn't let me get rid of that mask if it was. Perhaps we need all... Okay, I can, uh, I can cope with this. Uh, no, it's right here. <laughs> I love the one-shot sword. That's just a, that's a lovely thing. I already gave my... No, it didn't. Good me. Do you just provide tips for those that want to play again? Ah. <laughs> yes, wouldn't you know. I, uh... I, I definitely knew how to find the Mask of Truth on the basis of my wearing the Mask of Truth. Okay. Oof! Uh. It done godded me. Oof, he done godded me again. There we go. Yeah, 
Yeah, that's right. I forgot about his, uh, his bombiness. This, this dungeon is not child safe. Or I guess maybe it is entirely child safe, because the child can certainly not reach this. You found the pain pills! No, it's arrows! Keep out of reach of children, though. Keep an eye out for any uh, rogue heart pieces. Ooh, it seems there's a really tiny little bit of hitbox where you can just barely avoid damage if you're sitting directly in front of him. There we go. Bomb! Okay. You got a bomb, chew! Uh, Alright. The question is, what am I blowing up here? I'm blowing up that, I guess. Alright. Maybe these lines in the floor can help. Yep. Let me use this... This line on the floor here, this tile seam... ...to line up my bomb chew. In fact, I can do it like this. Okay. And... Okay, well, it had promise. <laughs> A little bit far away, though. Alright, let's stand on the, the tile seam here. Let's center it. There we go. Do I have to... Oop! Right. <laughs> um, a fourth day glitch. Oh, right. I did not do a fourth day glitch. That sounds interesting. Okay, I'm misaligned here. Okay, that should be fine. Uh, I feel off-center. I don't like this. Okay, that should be good. Alright, loving that. And... Oh, okay, that's fine. I was thinking we had to detonate it early, but also you can just hold it. Detonate it early by shooting it with an arrow. But that is also just holding it and then releasing it after a time is also a solution. A much simpler solution, it has to be said. Um, any heart pieces hanging out back here? Nope. There it is. Mine. Nom nom nom. Loving the full heal. But, uh... Now what? That what? Okay. Let's line ourselves up with this seam here. Uh, not quite. I think this should do. Or, tell you what, this texture seam here should put it directly in the corner. Or, okay, no, there's an easier way. If I stand directly on the point here, it 
Um, I am in, uh, I am in the moon. So I don't, I, I assume there's not supposed to be a, a timer right now. Okay. Meanie, meanie, miney, drop. Okay. Eeny, meeny, drop. There we go. Um, you can only get here on the the final day. So I assume it vanishes because um, that's the only possible time you can be here. Found. Let's run some Twitch ads here. All right. Apologies to Twitch fam. Gotta do what you gotta do. <clears throat> you found me. Hey, I want more masks. Don't we all? Oh boy. All right. Time to relinquish the bunny hood. More. He is consuming everything, isn't he? Mask of truth time. More. Cafe's mask. More. The couple's mask. <laughs> Thanks. You're nice. Can I ask a question? Your true face. What kind of face is it? The face under the mask? Is that... Is that your true face? That's a good question. If I were to, for no good reason, reset time to day one, would I be maskless? I suppose you probably... Um... If I had to guess, yes. Which is why they don't let you relinquish your transformation masks. You, the, they don't let you surrender these. So you probably can return to day one right now. And make it all the way back here. And if I had to guess... Um... The Moon Man will remember that you've surrendered so many masks already. Big butterfly. Is it time to talk to you now? You've got four, uh, four flowers of sati satiation around you. Everyone has gone away, haven't they? Will you play? You don't have any masks left, do you? Well, let's do something else. Let's play good guys against bad guys. Yeah. Let's play that. Cool Ranch Deity Mask! Wahoo! Could this mask's dark powers be as bad as Majora? Try it on! Heck. <laughs> Are you ready? You're the bad guy. And when you're bad, you just run. That's fine, right? Well, shall we play? Fierce Deity's Mask. Oh, yeah. God mode! I guess. <laughs> Presumably. Hmm. 
Majora's Mask. Remember your battles. When something resistant would deflect your weapons, what was its backside usually like? What a rude question to ask. Oh, right! I can, uh... I have... I have projectiles. I have unlimited distance. I have lasers of time. And infinite health, it seems. Nope, I don't have jump lasers, though, unfortunately. Oh my! Majora's Incarnation. The boomerang can be used. Uh, okay. Ooh. Nope. Can't transform into, uh, into Zora Link. I'll take some Madge. Ooh, okay. And attack! Get tripped! Oh, gosh. Majora's Wrath. It just doesn't end. We still have, uh... We got four fairies in our pocket here. And we'll put them to good use, why not? I'm, I'm, I'm trying to... <laughs> Spam A to make lasers. There we go. Oof. There we go. Get wrathed upon. Any more freaky appendages gonna pop out of your head? Yeah. Uh. Get evaporated. Hopefully without any collateral damage. Oh, yeah. It's the greatest pride parade of all time! With a little bit of The More You Know. Ooh, dawn of a new day. Ah! <laughs> He's awake! They, they live here now. That's just... 
They're just they're just always there now. They they smell a bit. I guess you get used to it. You guys You hadn't forgotten about me. You still thought of me as a friend. Yeah, I suppose if you happen to have an apartment with a view of precisely a giant's ass crack, <laughs> rent would probably drop a little bit. <laughs> did you... did you save me? I thought they didn't want to be friends with me. But they hadn't forgotten about me. Friends are a nice thing to have. Could you be my friend too? <laughs> you have the same smell as the fairy kid who taught me that song in the woods. I know, I know. Let's do something. Oh. So the evil has left the mask after all. Well now, I finally have it back. <laughs> Still jarring. Since I am in the midst of my travels, I must bid you farewell. Shouldn't you be returning home as well? Whenever there is a meeting, a parting is sure to follow. However, that parting need not last forever. Whether a parting be forever or merely for a short time, that is up to you. <laughs> With that, please excuse me. Yeah, I was gonna say one of those, the, 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 a couple of those masks definitely resemble uh, other other uh, entities. For instance, Elvis and Mario, and I guess they canonically do exist in in this universe. But my, you sure have managed to make quite a number of people happy. The masks you have are filled with happiness. This is truly. A good happiness. Well, both of us have gotten what we were after. So, this is where you and I part ways, isn't it? You know, that's kind of fun. Well, <laughs> it's almost time for the carnival to begin. So, uh, why don't you just leave and go about your business? The rest of us have a carnival to go to. Achoo! <laughs> Flank! Thank you. Yeah, you know, I guess admission to the carnival is not free, and, uh, I think I only had, like, 12 money on me. So, I guess I can't, I can't afford to get in. Hooray! The complete end credits. Wahoo, I'm glad for that. I didn't know that was a thing. Buckle up! 
Oh yeah. Majora's Mask defeated. The good ending as well. What a trip. She got her voice back. So that... Uh, that conflict resolved itself. That's good to know. I was thinking about, like, in a single time loop, conceivably you have enough time to beat all of the temple bosses and then go do Majora's Mask. And I don't know if that has any influence over over this at all. I was contemplating doing that, but then clearly I didn't, so. Maybe that's a thing that can be done, maybe it's not. Or, well, pretty sure it can be done, but I don't know if it has an effect. Well, monkey's fine. And everything worked out for everybody. Of course, I'm still obviously waiting for, to see some Anju and Cafe... Uh, uh, closure. The postman is free! Ostensibly. Um, well, completing the... Completing the dungeons themselves, like, in their entirety, I don't think there's enough time. But, at the begin beginning of every dungeon, there's a teleport pad to just take you to the boss of the dungeon. And I think if you make use of those... of the fast travel to all the bosses, you can do all the bosses in a single... uh, time loop. And then still have time to, uh... take care of Majora's Mask. Nice shooting, Tex. A little bit of Link theme. Perhaps a... A, 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 a particularly proficient Majora's Mask player might be able to, uh, in a single time loop, um, collect all the fairies in every dungeon, defeat all the dungeon bosses, and then do, uh, do Majora's Mask in a single time loop. <sighs> I don't know if that is... I mean, it'd have to be real good <laughs> to, to do all that in a single time loop. But maybe it it might be possible. If it is possible, it's certainly really close. Yeah, but also clearly all of the all of the bad juju all over the area uh, resolved itself. Mister Mummy Man is. Returned to normal. Ah, oh, yay! I am hap. Oh god, Tingle, why? Nobody invited you! <laughs> Dang it, Tingle. I would like to see Tingle's invitation. I don't think he has one. I think he's crashing. Right. I was curious about that. About that tree. 
Ever since I started playing, I've been curious about that tree. Time for some heartfelt graffiti. Oh, they're friends. Yeah. <laughs> Nicely done. Little bit of sorry is song. The end. Ugh. Oh, lovely. Oh, lovely. I'm so thrilled, too, because now I've I've not only played, but completed Majora's Mask, which means I can do Majora's Mask randomizers in the future, as well as, I mean, I've, I compl I've, played, I've played Ocarina dozens of times in my life, so I've always been able to do Ocarina uh, randomizers without any spoilers, but especially <laughs> now, Ocarina and Majora randomizers, that sounds like a lot of fun that I can start having on the channel. Wahoo. I wonder if there's any any art what inputs can I perform here? Or am I just uh I, I love how <laughs> this is such a retro game thing where the game just it just you get not like right now I'm not even soft locked. I'm just hard locked. <laughs> the game, the game is <laughs> functionally crashed right now and that's just how old games did. <laughs> you just put the end on the screen and then crash. That's hooray. You have no choice. You can't do anything but reset the console. <laughs> but it's all extremely exciting. In fact, let's go ahead and let's do a reset. Let's see what uh let's see what happens here. Reese in the played. Majora's mask. Yeah, let's see what happens when we reload the save. Flank. I have mask out of twenty-four. Dawn of the first day. Seventy-two hours remain. Okay. So I think it might just be... I still have the extra heart pieces, though. So yeah, it... Oh! Dang! No, yeah, with the every single mask, including Fierce Deity. <laughs> Wahoo! Neat! Yeah, excellent! Alright, if I felt like collecting the last two bottles, I could. We technically didn't. There's still a little bit more what can be done here. For instance, the postman has a little bit more, and the, the mystery toilet NPC we never met. But it's all good. But heck, that's... That's game right there. Can I... No, I can't. Fierce Deity Mask, I think, is only usable in boss rooms, I think I remember reading. But heck and gosh, what a trip. Loved it. Oh, let's get back. Let's uh, let's hop up on our uh, our plinth here, shall we? No, no, no. It's plinth time. Here we go. Wahoo! Loving it. Bonk! And that's Link. Oh, what a what a joy and a delight this has been. Um, if this is your uh, first time here, this is very much what we do. We play beloved old games for the first time and we enjoy the heck out of them so if uh and uh, the very next beloved old game we're gonna play and enjoy the heck out of is uh earthbound that's right this thursday at 1 p.m chicago time i'm gonna go live with my very first earthbound playthrough Oh yeah, that's gonna be a trip. <laughs> yeah, woo! I don't know how to feel about that. Other than excited for sure. But if this uh, 
this all sounds exciting to you, I recommend a like, a follow, subscribe, etc. It's fast and free, and it'll keep you connected for our future retro gaming shenanigans. Um, if you're already a fan, something you can do to help grow the channel is you can uh, make some clips on Twitch. Um, you can also, on YouTube, leave a comment with a timestamp to your favorite moments. I can uh, take that timestamp and convert it into clips and put them all over the internet and got a lot of good attention that way. Um, we're also at 99 followers on Twitch. I don't know who wants to be lucky number 100, but it's right there, ripe for the taking. Anyone who wants it, you can only be number one once, or number one, number 100 once. <laughs> um, like I said, on Thursday, 1 p.m. Chicago time, Earthbound begins. And this weekend, every weekend in fact, um, my wife and I do uh, co-op Stardew shenanigans. Some nice, relaxed, chill Stardew times with the wife. It's nice, it's pleasant, it's fun. Uh, so you are of course invited to hang out for that as well. But that'll have to be all for today, friends. Thank you all very much for hanging out. Your companionship is, as always, extraordinarily appreciated loving it it's great this was a great time i'm so happy to have been to have experienced majora's mask in its entirety it's about time ha <laughs> ha yeah good one all right <laughs> remember as always be kind to yourself be kind to others and take care have a good one <laughs>